So we last left off uh, a Norse I character. Eat well, he voluntarily eaten. You jumped in the suit willingly. Well, I don't remember yeah, Vor I'm happening in this in last week's episode. Yes, there was lots of armor on armor Vor. Right. So. This is what you hear in your mind over and over and over again. Be there are or... three machine spirits talking to me. Oh, boy. Yeah. I'm going to ignore it. Well, I register it, and I'm not addressing it. That's already a goal. All right. <clears throat> Someone has drank all of my coffee. Sweet. It was me. It was me. Sorry. Damn. <laughs> yeah, how how did you know that we love coffee so much? We drank all your coffee. And that's what that's what your suit does. Oh, interesting. Mm -hmm. Yes, do you have a question? <laughs> I'm Except arguing this... with the machine spirit of this suit. Stand by. No, as it's as it's thinking, or oh, then sorry, as it's going to strike, like it's going to strike. It's raising its right arm as it's going to strike someone in front of it. One of the followers, one of these guys in front of you, and. Stand back, the machine spirit of this suit is strong-willed. Yep. Uh, you can do a willpower save here, if you could try to stop what's about to do. Again, let me pull up my sheet. Uh, 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 it's somewhere in here. That's the wrong tab. I command the rest of the squad to pull guns upon uh, Karen. Oof. Oh, okay. Yeah, don't try and restrain me or anything. <laughs> I well, mean, you got to be able to restrain yourself, buddy. If you can't hold this armor back, you know. Do I have any? Can't armor? hold this armor back. It's gonna start getting holes melted in it. Right. Uh, it's gonna be uh minus ten, and then whatever ability, whatever modifiers you got to help with willpower saves. Wait, what? I'm minus ten. Yeah, minus ten on the on the check, and then whatever abilities you have to give you bonuses to your willpower save. I don't. Does anyone have any thing to help him with his willpower saves? I mean, fate uh, there possibility I, I, I technically do, but only against fear. It's not fear. Yeah, that's um, what I'm saying. It's the only it's <laughs> <a different laughs> rally and it... plus thirty to all attempts at mind that's control. It. That would be that would that would probably work right there. Okay, that's a, it, a special ability for being a keeper. That would probably work right there because it's not really mind okay. controlling you, but it's like your body is now it. So yes, okay. so yeah, plus so thirty. That's, that's about that's about it. Okay, I so did he's... put that divine symbol on the armor. Does that affect him? Huh? I uh, did carve that divine symbol into the armor. He gives plus thirty to willpower saves. Does that affect him or? Yeah, you, you have another plus 30, then. I think I did that last session at the end. The symbol does what now? Get plus 30 to willpower saves against demonic entities and such. There you go. So you get plus 50, then, instead of minus 10. So there you go. So your, your hand comes down to your side and stops. And you that kill the heretics faintly fades into the background of your mind. Excellent. Inside, I'm yelling at the suit to calm down. <laughs> One of the four machine the spirits in here is going to cooperate. Seeing him gain control of himself, I nod at the rest to put their guns down. I sadly put away my melted pistols. <laughs> 
All your silver guns about to jump in on this action. Target took what? Stand by. Isn't that That's thing in inside of his suit? <laughs> so it's the machine Shutting spirit down. of the uh, sentry gun. So I've got my suit's machine spirit. It's on his shield. Yeah, it's on his yeah. shield. It, yeah, the big suit's machine spirit. And then there's the machine spirit of the uh, sentry gun. And they're all just talking in my head. <laughs> right. Uh, there's a party going on. <laughs> so the guys, you just see them kneel down before you. And just kind of like uh, worshipping you at this point. What are you doing? The, not, the... not this again. No, no, no. The, these what people. do you mean again? <laughs> yeah, the people that came in, they're all worshipping you. Like, they was right. They was right. Oh, oh this is a normal thing that happens. Like, this really yeah. is normal. Yes, amongst Don't like, look too much into it, sister. <laughs> I'm amazed you haven't seen it yet, but we also haven't walked among normal people in a while. So is today the day to walk? He's not the god emperor, you filthy heretics. <sighs> right. Karam oh. just kind of shakes his head slightly. No, but we are his the children of his children. We are his grandchildren. Don't make me pull out the flagellation whip. <laughs> Pinky. It's just been at my side this entire time on my hip. I've got one. Sure you didn't steal that from the uh, Repentia? No, this is standard for all sisters. Oh, very well. Yep, you just see a flock of people coming in. I start whipping anybody who kneels down. Okay. There appears to be a gaggle of guardsmen here. They start enjoying it. Well, not guardsmen. They're the um, not that kind of whip. Those are the uh, civilians. Yeah, the civilians. The poor people. Yeah, the poor people you guys encountered last session. He's you see him chanting and ooing and eyeing and pointing at the the guy in big armor. And anybody chanting or or any sort of worshiping is getting hit with a uh, a whip meant to cause severe pain. They take it as a um, reward, I guess. Bad. I'm no. about to say, I think no. they're going to see it as a reward. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, considering, <clears throat> I mean, if I'm not mistaken, there is a thing actually where the presence of Space Marines actually puts people in a state of awe. Uh, you yeah, guys all are saying this is a normal thing. <laughs> this this yeah. happens yeah. when we walk amongst any normal civilian population. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to turn on my internal Vox. I suggest we get moving. So you I guys... Like this gathering is going to get yeah. bigger. You hear that bellowed from the suit. My suit? Bellowed, yeah, bellows out in very like demonic voice to the crowd. Be gone, filth. Karno turns around. <laughs> I'm going to smack the helmet. Silence you. I was coming from the chest area. Ow, like, I'm like, <laughs> yes, we'd be locking that away. When In my head, that. I have a grenade and I will use it. Ah, uh, so the one of the civilians walks up to you and says, What would you have us do, my lord? How many of you are there? And they just like, What's in the room? This is everyone. Yeah, it's everyone. Mm. Women, children, men, men with guns. Uh, you see a couple of them have space, uh, chaos space marine helms. That's our chest plate. Yeah, they, it's chest plate armor. I'm going to turn on the comms, or the Vox to Heracleides. Should we send them to the dropship? No. The dropship won't have enough room. Mm. Right. It's an in-and-out mission. What do you want done with them? But if they do want to prove themselves to the Emperor, we can use that. I propose we save the women and children and take the men, the able-bodied men, with us. We can throw them at the Chaos Cultists. They can die in glory, fighting for their home and for their Emperor. I concur. 
That was a private vox to Eric Lady's, but I'm oh, glad oh, you sorry, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> no, that happened then. So, all right, I did not say anything. I forgot uh, the uh, part where it was private. Oops. <laughs> Uh, I said back you were saying echo. knowing it was private and that you heard none of it. <laughs> <laughs> or he broke into the Vox. Uh, I'm going to turn the external Vox back on and uh, say, I have a mission to achieve here. You will help us. I'm going to gesture to Librarian Eric Ladies. We're here to retrieve several of his brothers. Prove your worth to the Emperor and your outstanding loyalty. Excellent. We've wasted enough time here as it is. Yep. And they, they, they just, all of you. Yep. They acknowledge what you say. They just blankly stare at you. And they'll follow you. So, <laughs> Show follow us the way you. through. We need to get to these center facilities. Now we have a gaggle of people. Now they're the telling you, they're telling you those fancy men in the armor up above that uh, kidnapped a lot of their people. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, they said they don't really know the way in. Uh, they just come down here and they deal with them as they come. They said there is a passageway, but they didn't. They dare not go that way. The, no one ever returns. And uh, then show us this passageway. Also, isn't the uh, oh, that one scout still guy still with us? Yes, he is. He knows where to go. I cool. just realized my Google Notes did not transfer over from my desktop to my yeah, laptop. He's, he's right here. See. Oh, no, I, just, I don't remember his name. All of my notes are gone. Uh, he was a lieutenant. I remember that. I, I got in the chat. Yeah, yeah he's, he's there. Torian. I believe. Right. Yeah, Torian, Torian, lead the way. Uh, he says there's no way we can bring these people uh, where we're going. But if... He's telling you some private vox, by the way, as well. Mm -hmm. uh, what would you have us do with these individuals? Use them as cannon fodder against what's up ahead? Yes. Yep. Okay. All right. And we're moving. And he faced through the wall. Well, to you, he just disappeared. He just cloaked, boom, gone. Whoa. So did half of the guards are the uh, oh no civilians. the door is closed. What do we do? <laughs> no, I actually can't get through the. I still can't get through, through it either. I can see through it, but I can't get through it. Here we go. Uh, okay. Oh, here we go. It's like you got to crouch low. The door didn't open all the way. Ah, what? very well. I got to crouch. Hold low. up. Oh, I can control two characters. Apparently, that's not supposed to happen. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty I sure I have the ability there. to control uh, uh, Virlo. No, I think we gave sight to somebody because he shared vision or something. Yeah, yeah that would have been me. Got shared sensors. Yeah, Vir Virlo's got uh, full control for everybody. Yeah. yeah. I mean, technically, we all share senses. I know. Or we shared targeting. You, just, uh, you see him. Yeah, so, uh, yeah you see. Uh, what was his name? Eternian. Eternian. Torian, blood up above. Yeah, Torian. He, you just see him wait, uh, motion to stop, halt, and he points. He goes two, and then points up ahead. Crom uh, understands and nods silently through the personal comms. Uh, I ask, is this the only way through? Uh, he says, "There's." A another path, but it's a lot more treacherous. So Define treacherous. More of these mutants might not survive them. And then we send the people in to fight them, and we just move through while they're fighting. How many? Uh, yeah, let's say how many hours do we have left? My notes are gone. You've got five, if I remember correctly, something like that. And it's gonna take you about. Uh, two or two or three to go down below and then up above again. So it's gonna. Eric, ladies, they're your. They were your charge. I'm yep. gonna 
So you're order, fault to you. Yeah, you're ordering you're, them uh, forward to uh, distract them, so that way we can just move past and keep going. Okay, so they're fighting that now. I mean, they're I'll give probably them a nice getting... motivational speech as I go by. Yeah, they're promptly getting slaughtered, but uh, you guys are able to blink on by. Tells you this is the way down down this way. He says, "Be careful. There are known to be uh, chaos space marines that venture down forth and set up traps and other instruments to capture people, convert them, uh, convert them, eat them, whatever they do with them." He's not quite sure. Could have sworn I saw a warp entity hole spider just now. It's a remnant from a time long ago. No, but it was a giant spider. You saw a mutant spider. I don't like those. Uh, I'm just they're not made of cables in the, in the ground. This corridor. No, 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 not those spiders, the mutants. Uh, How about the uh, Chaos Space Marines up ahead? I don't like them either. Yeah, uh, so you see very hulking uh uh, not dreadnoughts, but pretty close to it. Two of them, and then a couple of Chaos Space Marines behind them, and you see them basically scalping people on the ground, scalping them, and then picking up various traps. And those dreadnoughts are kind of just uh, salvaging pieces off of the ground, parts of the uh, facility. What are the odds and then in this it. armor I could bullshit myself through? Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. Wait, they still have the helmets? I'm pretty sure they're here to kill me or something, so I don't. <laughs> yeah, don't you not have a helmet? I do have a helmet. I have a Mark III helmet. <laughs> so it's an old piece of shit. <laughs> you're going to you're try to bullshit your way to these guys? They They look different than you. But you still look very chaotic. Okay. Internally, I'm going to tell the Sororitas they hear absolutely nothing of the next conversation. You hear that in your mind? Uh. Do you mean through the I am preparing myself to do something that would be considered... Machine spirit, in his mind. Go ahead. Questionable. I'm going to walk forward and say, I am Alfarius. <laughs> A what now? Oh my god. <laughs> I am Alfarius. Can I shoot him? <laughs> Can I change, like, yeah, chop him down? I just said you don't hear this at the surface. So you hear that. I don't, I don't hear this. Everybody uh, else does. No, no, no. And I'm telling you not to hear it. You actually do uh -huh. hear it. But... So you're going to deceit? Yes. <laughs> okay. Let me, uh, yeah, I'm pulling uh, from my characters. Let's go with lore. I think it's a deception, Jack. So deception would be they'd scrutinize against you, or what would they do? That would be a willpower, a fellowship test, I imagine. They'd it's probably, like... no, they'd probably scrutinize. Okay. Yeah, that's a deceive check. That's an actual... I don't of... think, I don't they're think not they're, alpha they're not alpha. Would they really care if you were alfarious? No. Well, I am Alfarius is an Alpha Legion greeting. Oh, okay. So I am literally just greeting them as Alpha Legion. Gotcha. Which isn't necessarily a lie. It's just um, uh -oh. 8,000 years old. Gotcha. Uh, deception. I think it's on your... could be a skill yeah. on your character sheet. Uh, there we go. Deceive. Yeah, deceive, deceive, deceive. And they're going to scrutinize against Please be good. Yeah. there. Um, you yeah. might want to fade point that one. Yeah. Who was the who was the brother? So they're going to see right through your Omega. bullshit. But go I'm ahead. Yeah. Yeah. I am Omega is what you actually said. <laughs> <laughs> Do I want to try and fade point that? Yes. Yeah, yeah I'll fade point. Remember, you get a plus 10 to your roll from the fate point. Yep. 
Uh, I doubt he will surpass their scrutiny, but we can try. I don't mean to do unknown voice, but stupid thing. If I can click on the thing, this laptop is really weird. Again. Oh, oh. Is it? They, they, the dreadnought hesitantly comes up, looks at you. Where is your unit? Who's your commander? Can't you see them? They're here amongst us. He looks at them and he's going to scrutinize because he's not going to buy the guys in black armor or your unit because they're all wearing red and covered in blood and guts, whereas your team is not. And I'm hiding around the corner so he doesn't see. Me. Right, so <laughs> it's gonna be it's yeah. gonna be it's gonna be minus thirty on this one. What if I try to intimidate <laughs> him? And... Or not not minus thirty um, plus thirty. I meant plus thirty. Plus thirty on these guys. Are... Plus thirty. Wow, that would have still, still failed. Fails. Yeah. Does it? Oh, okay. So they it's buy. <laughs> yeah, they they buy it. Yeah. <laughs> we'll return. And then he asks, uh, "What were your orders?" I don't remember any of the unit being down here. Dom, of course you wouldn't have been told what our orders were. I'm gonna in inter I'm swapping to the internal Vox real quick. Real quick. Eric, ladies, roll with it with me. Yep. I I'm gonna have to. <laughs> Just for the notes. I'm hating every moment of this. I know, but the closer we can get without setting off the alarms. Going back to external Vox, hunting down survivors from the crash. And he, he looks I you follow there. the will of Alpharius. And he tells you there were survivors? Not had... anymore. It's like, we weren't told of any survivors. <laughs> Not anymore. Now, they adorn a pile of skulls. A gift, as it were. Interesting. He says, we're going to need you at the main line defenses. We're down here salvaging... Uh, more bodies for the weapon, so we don't need you down here. So they're telling you, return Excellent. back to your post. Very well. <laughs> I'm clicking over to Eric, ladies. Hopefully, the sororitas does not cause any issues, and they can continue through. Well, we'll get you close, can, and then we'll see. You and can try positioning. <laughs> Since you're so big, you can try basically acting as a yeah. blocker for her so that they uh, wouldn't see her. Can she grab onto the inside of my shield? Yeah, that's what I was. We'll and she, it she's again. got that camo cloak thing, so. I, yep, I can just put that on myself, I guess. <laughs> yeah, just grab onto the inside of the shield and I'm just going to carry it. All right. Which one of them is the Cyclops? Wh whose eye are we stabbing? So, I call you I sheep from now on. Yeah, I'm. <laughs> I'm going to, as you guys are doing that, I'm going to do three rolls of this because they're going to be still looking at you guys as you guys are walking through. Are we going left or right? That uh, This is, I guess, they're checking. With the, uh... Yeah, they're just they're scrutinizing you since you're trying to hide someone, so I imagine it would be a scrutiny check as you're walking. Uh, how good is the Sororitas' uh, disguise? <laughs> or would that be silent move? <laughs> Well, I'm not moving. I think it would be yeah, concealment. Yeah. It would be, it would be concealment, concealment, which luckily is basic, and I have and decent I, I, agility. I am plus, trained in concealment too. Well, I'm not. You, yeah, plus twenty if you hide behind the shield, and then you're going to do. Are you strapping her to the shield, or are you holding on for dear life here? Uh, I mean, I can. I could do both. Check. I could move the shield up against my chest if needed. Strength okay. check for you to hold on to the shield as you're walking, being. But if he's holding, if he's pinning you against his armor with the I shield, I can do either one. I yeah, yeah, I can I can just pull the shield slightly closer to me. Then it's just the uh, concealment checks, three of them. You have to beat those. Me or him? Him? Oh, her? Okay. Did you say it was plus twenty? Plus twenty if he's hiding you behind the shield. All right. Plus that cloak thing gives what another twenty or was it thirty? I think That's, it's twenty. Right. If you're going through them. It's gonna be another scrutiny check, and it's gonna be minus. Uh, Which this uh, this could fail at any time. I am not trained in this, Lieutenant. Where are we going? 
Oh yeah, we're, we we understand. We're pretty that killed them all. <laughs> oh yeah, no. If need be, I will just immediately let you go. Damn, nice. Well, Let's the lieutenant. Check. Yeah, the lieutenant. Um, you see him like no longer see him. But he tells you you're you're gonna want to go right. Uh, the, okay. So like, I'm gonna casually, as if I own the place, walk this way. Got it. <laughs> I'm just cutting a hard corner turn. And I asked, how did you get past them? <laughs> He's like, I've never, you just walked like you owned the place. <clears throat> to, uh, on a vox to him, I'm just going to say, I have been a part of many battles over my years and learned when to fight and when not to fight. Sometimes, words are just as deadly as a last pistol. Says, now that we've got the patrols, we're going to be heading south this way. Sun Tzu said he will win who knows when to fight and when not to fight. Clearly, that what are you talking about? The emperor said, said that. that, yeah. Who is Sun Tzu? The emperor said that. And he knows a little bit more about fighting than you do, pal, because he invented it and then he perfected it so that no man can best him in the ring of honor. <laughs> Very true. <laughs> I feel that that's somewhat incorrect, but okay. <laughs> uh, does, am I still carrying the Sororitas? Or is she, uh... It's up to you. Uh, on internal comms, I'm just gonna, like, well, I'm just gonna angle the shield so it's a little bit easier for her to, like, lay on the shield while I'm carrying it. And then he took two of every animal and put them on a boat and he beat the crap out of every single one. And ever since then, any time a bunch of animals are together in one place, it's called a zoo. Unless it's a farm. <laughs> Rookie, silence on the comms. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> he, the scout comes up ahead. You see the, the hand go up as, as well. And he points too. And he goes, points in the distance. Very well. And then you see him move over. And then he he goes, you see him hold up five, and then two, and then in, down the hall. And he's pointing down the hall. He's hang on, he does five, and then he holds up two. He goes five, two, and then he Seven. points down the hall. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Megan sure I was, I was reading that right. Because double flash five, I was like, is he going to about the double flash five, or is he going to hold one up and then, and no. then a, a blank hand down? Because that'd be ten. And then you see some... Weird symbol hit him flash as well after that was five, two with his hand. Any of you guys trained in military lore? Uh, yes. Yes, technically. All of us. Okay. So plus 20. He's telling you with that signal it is some some beast, like a, 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 a war beast of some sort. <laughs> Like war beast sighted. That's the that's the best uh I, presentation for that. So it's gonna be a demonic war beast of some sort. The scout has no idea what's going on. I relay that's I relay the information to uh uh Krom. Yes, I, my, my understanding. Hearing it. war beasts and knowing we're fighting corn do use a demonology deck. Oh wrong. To try and think of what it is we're about to fight or face. Do we have a demonology? <clears throat> I'm he a does. freaking space wizard. Of course I have demonology. Yeah. <laughs> I'm about to say he does. I have no idea. <laughs> right, I'm gonna... Eric Clayton the things you'll kill. Why would the, we do uh, that? Savortus can uh, slide off if she needs to. Eric Clayton sure, succeeded the demonology roll, Boko. Yes. What'd you get? What kind of roll did you get? It was a 1.6 success. Okay. Uh, it could be various things. It could be hellhounds. It could be... So, until you have eyes on it, you won't know per se, but you're thinking hellhounds of some sort. Corn usually uh, deploys those with scout parties. I don't think I can bluff my way past that thing. Not a hellhound. I mean, if we fight them, we're probably fighting the guys to the north, too, because this is the same hall. Yeah.
Well, we can try Let's, and We can kill them again. silently and quickly. Yeah, we can try and uh, do it fast. And if we can bullshit our way through. I look at Karnoth. I get in position. You want me to try and I mean, look at the keeper? Our way past? Uh, you certainly can. You try and bluff our way through. And if not, me and Karnoth will stand close to the other two. There's one for each of us. And get ready uh, to strike. If we are to strike them down as quickly and as silently as possible, I will leave my shield here on the stairs. And equip my sword in two hands. <clears throat> Unfortunately, my fancy sniper rifle, that's my only silent weapon, can't shoot around corners. <laughs> uh, what if you're still being held close to me, though? Just, like, hidden behind the shield? <laughs> that's going to be a very awkward position, but... <laughs> I mean, worst comes to worst, I can just immediately drop you. If I charge. Do you want to try that or no? I'm untrained in concealment. It's up to you. Well, if, you, if the bluff is going to work, you have to be in a shield anyway. Yeah, Fair. so... I mean, unless we want... Yeah, because if we just hide you with the shield again, and I just keep the front of the shield towards them, it's taller than you, or at least as tall as you. So if the bluff fails, you're fully concealed still. If the bluff passes, well... We'll address that as we get to it. Then I just don't move. Yeah. Yeah. So, so if it, we're gonna do the bluff fun. first, I'm gonna go pick up my shield. Yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna bluff it. Yeah. Give me a second. Let me try and remember. But while he's to trying to bluff, we're gonna get in a position to quickly strike them if yep. it goes wrong. Right. Promise trying to remember I don't some, again. The, uh, Fine. some of the old dumb shit. You're gonna uh, try to bluff your way through? Yes, give me a second. Uh this is this is Here, me. I'll pick up and hold your shield for you. Stuff. I hold his shield. Oh, what was what was the second challenge? Appreciate it. Nope, doesn't remember anything useful. Because my armor can wield my staff for me. Oh, yeah. Your armor can hold stuff? My armor can hold my staff, specifically. Stand by, turret. Talking like what? Wait, why am I moving? <laughs> yeah, I'm still holding that shield. There yeah, you. I picked up I picked up uh, Karnoff's shield. Not All right. Not Karen's shield. No, no, he knows. He's like, <laughs> why is he moving? Krom steps out and begins approaching the... What are these? Just regular Black Legion? These guys are corn. Falls are okay. Corn. They, are, they are corn. Warhound yeah. locked on. Stand by, turret. Okay. Krom is going to just walk straight just... up to them and says... They kind of toward the front line, right? They they halt you. It's like, who are you with? I am Alfarius, returning from my mission. What mission was that? Tracking down what was left of those from the crash site. He's like, I don't remember you being here in our forces down here. I wasn't. I got detoured. Interesting. Who's your commander? No one oh, now. Fairness. He's dead. <laughs> I respond to Alfarius. They, they, you respond with Alfarius? <laughs> yes. He just kind of looks puzzled, looks at the other guy, and he looks at you, and he's going to scrutinize. He's not buying what you're putting down. Nice. I aim at his head. I grip my sword tighter. I have my sword. <gasps> you did it! <laughs> Holy shit. Hey, hey, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh my wait, wait, wait. god. The server torque gun Terry did the script. Oh no! <laughs> no, not yet. The server thinks that you're Alfarian. He shoots you. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it's the it's the Space Marine. He he buy he kind of buys what you're talking about. I remember seeing you, but I don't want to take my chances. I don't feel like dying this day. No, we'll let the Loyalists do that. Right. They and their false god will fall. And he points at the Warhound. 
get scrutinized by the warhound before you be, get back to the front line. Or not scrutinized, but like they're gonna sniff you out. They do it. Mm. This is a checkpoint. So. On the internal vox, it's I'm just gonna it's just get ready. Uh you ready for this, Sorotus? Yep. All right. So the dog, what, I wonder what the sentry organ that would be. The is your armor fully the unholy sealed? Nose. Unholy nose. I really nose. hope your uh, your armor is sealed. All right. So because we haven't gotten any combat against these guys for a while, just remember we all have a plus ten on our weapon skills and ballistic skill checks in melee because of our oath. We're also getting a plus five bonus on our weapons and ballistic skills because of our. Uh, Guess uh, what? Our, the dog. Our link. The dog Except doesn't for even smell this. Except he, for Sorus, yeah. Doesn't even smell you, dude. Oh, perfect. He had yeah. COVID in the it past. Seems, it seems it, as it's sniffing around you and looking at you, it appears in your eyes, it growls. Your suit growls back, and the beast settles back down. Oh my god, that's great. I'm that's amazed this is working. <laughs> shut, shut up. Why did you call it in the beast? <laughs> All right, All right. Keep going. <laughs> uh, right, going to the front lines. Yeah, the lieutenant tells you, like, I, I don't think I can get past this. Um, I'm gonna find another way around, you guys. All right, just tell us which corridor we need to go through immediately after this. We're still sharing vision with them, right? I'm gonna continue walking past, like I own the place. Right. Uh, and we hashtag YOLO. <laughs> I have been smelled. Uh, uh, well, you've been smelled, but everyone oh. else has been smelled now. Yeah. Uh, go get, go get uh -oh. smelt. Oh, great. Is this scrutiny? Mm hmm. But what am I rolling against on this? Like, I don't. Uh, concealment, I imagine? Okay. Any or you could, just, you could try like, and charm it. Or you can't it, I, intimidate it. Do you have any other abilities? I mean, is anybody I got, trained in I, I'm trained in concealment at plus 10. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Is oh. anyone trained in rankling or animal handling? Can I try to intimidate it uh, into not sniffing me or something? Okay. So you went, you went. Or uh, who was the first one up? 2.6. Uh, well, that's Virlo. Virlo got through. Modifier? No modifier. All right. So two people have made Eric it through. Eric, ladies. He smells you. Something's wrong with you. Mm, what do I get? I got a 24. I'll fate point that. Okay. <coughs> Can I intimidate the creature into not sniffing me or like oh my getting God. a oh, penalty? Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Guess what? You shouldn't have fate pointed. Oh, you're going to fate point that one? And I stab. Oh, we could try and stab. No, I just stabbed the Warhound. <laughs> You got a surprise round? Yes. Like, as, as soon as I realize that it's, uh, it's figured me out, I'm just stabbing the shit out of him. Someone keeps as moving soon as he the iPad. I'm gonna charge the so nearest one. I'm down here. Hey, do your attack, Eric, ladies. <coughs> hey. That's hilarious. He's like, no, I'm done pretending. We're not doing this no more. <laughs> so, if I hit... Not us in a good position. Now that I hit, I get to do a willpower check against it. Yeah, it block uh, you. And my degree of success gives me... Uh, every degree of success against his willpower uh, gives me an extra die. Okay. So I get a 20. Or, so. It can, it can counter. Warhound. Why did parry? I get no? No, it can't. No, it doesn't. Ha it can't parry, can it? It's a dog. You're right. Yeah. All right. Never mind. You hit it. Cool. But well, it still gets an opposed willpower check. So if it fails more than me, I oh, can get extra dice against it. It might. Why am I rolling It'll... so badly today? Jesus. Ah, it did. Still cool. good enough. I get two more extra dice on my damage roll against him. Yeah. It goes. Huh, what? So that's ow. God, I'm rolling like shit. Well, plus two d ten. Hang on. 
plus an additional 15. Wow, you almost one shot of this thing. Jesus. 30, 40, so well, 40. if I didn't roll a one for damage, I probably would have. But yeah, it is a pin of eight. Yeah, yeah, it, oh. has, no, it has no armor. So wait yeah. a second. Hold on, my um, my armor gives me extra strength. <laughs> Uh, so that should be one extra strength bonus. So two extra damage? Yeah, so two extra damage. It's, it looks like it's hurting and starting to phase, phase from existence, just... is what you're saying. Here, you see it, it looks, uh, you just smashed its head in, and it's like, the head's not there, but it's still trying to do something. Or it's slowly phasing in, like, you're like, you can tell this thing's about to be vanished with one more additional hit. Yeah, so that was a total of 42 damage with 8 pen. Right. Here, let me clear the tracker, too, so we can get... All right. Also, so... uh, the Reaper Staff is... Um, Psycho Reaper. Uh, I can hurt Ethereal or Incorporal be uh, beings. Yep. That's oh, and I gain Rending. Oh, uh, that means I can... Reroll that one? Reroll that one. No, that's okay. for tearing. Oh, shit, that's right. What does rending do? Oh, just oh it just damage. gains the damage type. I have impact and rending on my four staff. All right. Yeah, I attacked uh, the guy in front of me. By the okay. Way. I already rolled a 2.5. Okay. Uh, is he going to try to parry pad, or am I just doing damage? You're just doing damage because he's not expecting it. Oh, wait, no, that's that's the wrong thing. That's the wrong... Finger my bob. Because these guys are kind of like lackadaisical. You see them just kind of like chilling. Well, that particular one, you're you're uh, you smacked in the face is actually sitting on a chair of some sort. Yeah, I'm gonna hit it in the right leg. What's the armor in the right leg? Uh, I believe it was the same as you guys. Let me check. Because these guys are running yourself. To the initiative order, make sure your token is selected when you hit I the initiative button. My... Oh no, that's the other chaos marines. Hold up. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, so at twice, so twelve plus six, eighteen. These guys <clears throat> have eighteen in the leg with the a total, eighteen total in the legs. Yeah, sixteen head, eighteen legs and body. Thirty-seven damage goes through. How much? 30, 37. Oh, he's and dead. you can righteous fury that. I can. Uh, I'm going to do a... Before I do that, I'm going to do an acrobatics test. Oh, nice. Step to the next guy. Murder I him. succeed, and that means I can move up to half of my <laughs> movement. So I can just do this. I can come up to the Warhound, and since I just still have the righteous fury, I can just do another test. Let's see if I can hit tiny margin of success. I love it. It's all I need, baby. Alright. And boom. And... I presume it has no armor, so... No. Yep. I think you it's dead. Uh-oh. You, yep. it, you just see it disappear, basically. Just you flames and it boosts gone as soon as you hit it. Yeah, that's it. So I'm going to take a shot at this guy. Let's say. Oh, like, I was aiming on a shield. That was going to go next. Oh. Yeah, so you Never mind. Go ahead then. Let the two people right next to him go. Yep. Go ahead. Uh, Swords, just before I start whirling around, I'm releasing you, so go. Alrighty. First shot's going against this dude back here. Okay. No, he's dead. Is it? Oh, never mind. Dead. On the front right, still alive. Okay. I can use my multi melta at <laughs> point blank range. By the way, these are the head because I was aiming. Yeah, I'm about to go crazy on these two guys. <laughs> I'm just take them trying out to or... make sure that I don't fire first if we can you already, take them you all your on. Uh, nope, I still got another shot, but I yeah. don't know if that killed them or not. Uh, where's your damage? Oh, 14? Yep. 
Uh, pin of ten to where? Head. Ten. Uh, so six of that is absorbed then because he has sixteen on the head. So. Ooh. Yep. So, Second one goes for his head then too. So he's taking. Let's see. Eight on the first one. Eight. And then, uh, yeah, he's dead. Minus twenty. So are we loud out at this point? Well, I guess. Sure. Yeah, I guess they're going loud. So. Oh, we're still in the surprise round, aren't Sorry, we? Sorry, Bo Boko. Yeah. That was against this guy <coughs> in front over here. What? What guy? Oh well, then he's dead. The other guy's alive then. Yep. Is that your move? Yep, that's me. This is for the dude immediately next to me for the first attack. I'm left just, or right? Uh, to my right. Okay, the got it. Okay. Ooh. Speak on the right thing. So all these are going to be towards his head. He's that would outright kill him, wouldn't it? He's super. Even him in the chest, he's super dead. Okay, well, they, they so, only have 20 hit points, so. Oh, I'm close enough to hit the dude immediately to the left without moving, aren't I? Yeah. In this corridor. So yeah. I'm going to use the last two attacks from my three attacks. I'll reroll for hit on the dude to the left. Yep. And this, I'm going to roll for the damage. That he, also kills him. He That's is cool. also super dead. Even with, um, yeah, his armor doesn't exist to you. <laughs> Can I describe it, basically? <laughs> Go for it. So I'm standing there basically between the two of them, and you just see the giant shield in my right hand just go funk right through the guy on the right's head, and then the spear just goes funk through the guy on the left's head. Right. Just... And then I put him back down as if it was normal. <laughs> you can also fire. <clears throat> All the targets are dead. Hey, your servitor is like, hey, where'd my targets go? <laughs> Talking about quiet firing. Did you not see this? Up All here? targets dead. Nope. No, uh, there's two guys uh, up north of us. Yeah. The first two we passed through. Oh, I can't see them anymore. <laughs> oh, I Very can't well. see them either. Are they, well, somebody, I, don't, I do not see them. Roll for your attack. It can see it. Uh, if I can click on the right thing, give me a give second. yourself plus sixty if you're, you're using your plus six skill. I think it's on your character. You just made a weapon. Uh, two, two, two. wait, ranged weapons don't have a hit. They just have. Oh, there's the hit. I was like, what? I was like, wait a minute. What is that? Okay, there you go. I think it hits. It hits. Do damage. Things more like it hits, not you think it hits. It hits. I don't fire one shot. Or does that fire multiple shots? I don't know. You can fire full auto. Then How does that work? With an eight point one, that's that's firing a lot of rounds. Depends on how many has it in his clip, but whatever. A hundred in his clip. Sure. You can him. just do like uh, eight more additional hits. Yep. Go for it. Wait, do eight total hits? Yeah. Eight, eight more damage. Eight additional eight hits. Yep. Uh, so nine total. Okay. No, 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 not attacks. Uh, damage. Not, oh, yeah, just right. damage rolls. Whoops. So we got one, two. Yeah, that guy's three. dead. Uh, so well, do, you want to, do you want him to hit the other guy? The answer is yes. Yes. Okay. Three. So he, he kills both targets. Okay. That's with the three shots? Or do I need to do another shot? Uh, let's see if there's anyone else in... in hold up, let's well, see. If... You're, you're hitting with eight shots, so they're what's, fucked. What's, what's the range of that weapon? 100 meters? Yeah. Technically, yeah. you're hitting with nine shots, because zero degrees of success is still success. Wait, is, yeah. is the range 100 meters? Because that goes 100, 200, then 300? Yeah, because you, you have more targets up here that can hit, so... Uh. Fuck yeah, it, just, we're gonna we're gonna yeah, let keep, the turret go crazy. <laughs> yeah, keep keep rolling for damage then. Okay, uh, so I've done how well, many rolls? Three. So we've got yeah. another four, six, five, six, seven, 
eight, one, two, three, four. What's the damage to all that? And, and, and eight and nine. I need to do what? One more? Yeah, one more. Also, you can do a righteous fury. Only so, one. Uh, so, let's see, these guys see are dead. Shoot again. Plus twenty-four. These guys plus are yeah. These two are dead. Uh, so I'm at 107 damage so far. Give me a second. Plus okay, so these five, four are dead. Plus twenty-four. Plus. 20. Uh, it's 182 damage total. So let me get the calculator out because you eviscerated the four guys, no problem. Uh, let's see. So you said 120. Uh, I did 184 damage total. Minus 80 for those space marines you killed. So 104 is left over. T so, yeah. You well, actually hold up. How much number do these things have? Okay, so you did forty damage on one of the guys. Four, five, six. Let me just update the uh, kill counter. Don't worry about it. So yeah, I killed six guys in one volley. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm more worried about that other 100 damage only doing 40. Uh -huh. Also, remember, you have Righteous Fury, so you can attempt another attack from that, uh, because you got a 10 in your damage roll on one of those hits. So how does that work? You just yeah. roll the same exact modifiers to hit that you did with your previous hit. Uh, oh, only just one... Hmm? Yeah, it only did... Four... Yeah, only 40 got through and the, the, guy, the last guy had hit. So, yeah, just, so one, just, yeah, just one more uh, damage roll? No, no, not a damage roll. You make an attack roll to try and hit them again. Oh. With the exact same modifiers that you'd used before. Yep. That's the wrong thing. Ignore yeah. that. All right, so that's five more hits. Okay, let's see. One more. All right, and none of the no, that's five. No, I'm sorry, the sixteen got another righteous fury. Oh uh, no, that's uh, he rolled a one and a ten. Oh, and a ten. Oh, that's why it's blue. So yep. you can make another attack roll with that. So this is eighty-seven damage. Got it. That's the pen five. Where did that hit? Where did that one hit? The center of mass. He has fifty-four yeah, armor. Forty-five. Center, yeah. Yeah. Yes, 54 armor center mass. I don't, oh, I don't know. so that didn't do anything then. Yeah, I don't think this one did anything this time. Well, you did get a righteous fury, so you can attack again. I'm going to guess and say the party wants me to just do it again. Yeah. I mean, you ride righteous furies out. Unless there's like no one else to shoot. Or until your clip's empty. No, there's those two two nice. proto proto dreadnoughts you guys passed. Nice. A seventy three, where does that hit? A leg? Uh let's see. Seventy three. Uh yeah, right leg. Forty five in the leg. And then you said five? That's seven damage rolls. Yeah, seven. yeah, it's forty forty five in the leg. Oh, it's 45 armor on the leg? Oh, so there's no point rolling damage. Unless you yeah. want to try and get Righteous Fury again. But, unless you're aiming for the head or get a lucky roll for a headshot. Yeah, I can't really control, like, tell this turret to aim for the head. I only have that for melee weapons. Yeah. Uh, I doubt we'll... I doubt you're going to yeah, be able to I, actually damage it. We yeah. still have my uh, multi-melter. Yeah. Six. Yeah. Well, yours is probably going to be the only one actually damaging anything. He hasn't actually made his surprise round either, so... I could probably damage it. Yeah, let's see. Also, can you add me to the turn order? I rolled a... You rolled a 12, well, if I remember. Yeah, 12 plus my double initiative, so that'd be 8. Oh, I should probably roll initiative then, huh? Yeah. I, I don't know how to code in the double initiative from Lightning Reflexes, but it's 18. Um, I'll, I'll edit that. You can tell your gun is very happy with itself right now. <laughs> In my head, good turret. 
Target's dead. Target's dead. Target's dead. <laughs> yep. You mentally pat it on its head. Yes. <laughs> so we're shooting somewhere down here? Somewhere down the grand scheme of things. Well, you you know there's dreadnoughts in that direction. or the, You're not quite sure what kind of dreadnoughts. They just looked up. They're definitely not space marines. They're bigger. Doesn't sure. that thing have a uh, blast? What does? No, Mazel? Well. Yeah. Actually, uh, what are the odds he could destroy the door? Or one of the doors? Or just collapse the uh, the ceiling he, somewhere? I mean, he sees a big button on one of the doors over there. Anyone want to try and just slam the door? <laughs> or do we want to try and kill him now? If his blast doesn't kill it. Well, you know there's two of them. And you pissed off one. Yeah, no, no, no. It was, uh, it was, it was just a prank. Yeah, really. <laughs> just a prank, bro. We just happened to wipe out your buddies. They weren't strong enough. This is the way. Well, are they less than 75 meters? Oh, yeah. Are they no, less no, than 75? No. No. Really. They're they are not. Uh, Can you, so, for legal reasons, ping where they are? So they're going to be somewhere in this vicinity. Can you see that? Over 100, 150, 100, 150 meters. Yeah. 150, 160. You know, gen you know generally where they're at. So you're, bl you're shooting blindly, so you're going to take a penalty roll. So it is dark down here. Oh, so, it's 150. Well, it's like, my range, like my melter range is 100 meters. Yep. Melt and you're away. getting a plus 15 on your roll for our oath oh, and yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, shared senses. So how, so how much penalty do I get? Sorry, what's the range increments on your weapon? 100. Oh, so it's like a minus my 10? Yeah, I think, I think it's minus 10, yeah. Doesn't it do more damage the closer it is? Yes. Probably, yeah. It does. Yeah, if it is less than 50 meters, I do additional 1d10. I'd say just close the door. Let them come to us, and then they'll be well within range. Well, so far, the penalty, I still get plus 35. Oh, well, Even then, with the penalties. Then send it. Huh. <laughs> That's two hits if it's a, if it's a multi shot weapon. Uh -oh. That's two hits. No, no, I think I need to re-roll that. You need to re-roll that. That's oh, that's right, because your thing might explode. <laughs> I don't think it does. On no, no, his does. It's a his minus does. a plus or an energy. Plasma. Yeah. Oh, I see. Rolling in that hundred. Re-roll. It's a specific trait on his specific weapon. Yeah. The firestorm. I remember. Oh, that's, that's so much better. <laughs> yeah, please don't. Um, what's the word? Fucking explode! So who who spent the fate point there? I did. I thought you didn't Only have any fate. Oh, you have he one. Oh, we determined. Yeah, yeah, I we remember now. To have one now. All right, so. well, be, be right back. When the uh, who who's up next for the surprise round? Probably me, because I'm the only one who hasn't gone yet. Does that where does where does that hit? Where does that hit? Uh, oh, that's a two chest. chest. Oh. Uh, 56 armor and chest. So nothing. Holy shit. Rough. I do have Righteous Fury. Yeah, well, they're, yeah. They, well, you saw when you were passing by them, these guys were like, like proto-dreadnoughts proto or something. They're they really more robotic than man. So, really oh. hulking things. Yeah. You can roll again for the, the Righteous Fury, yeah. Okay. Back. Same modifier, correct? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Even better. Jesus, Marion Christ. I think that. No, it's a 40. Oh, yeah, that's right. 40? Yeah, because 04 would be a roll. So you swap that around and it becomes 40 for the location. Which is body again. Yeah. Yeah. But. 
Oh no, he said what, 56 chest? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, so they didn't do anything. I thought it would be more like four. No, he, he rolled a four, but. You rolled a four. Better. You rolled a zero four for your roll. So you reverse the numbers, so it's a four zero on the target. Okay. Yeah, that's how, that's how targeting or determining location works, is you reverse whatever it is that you rolled and then look at the table. And for what whatever is... reason, if you roll 100, you're hitting the head. But... But you're most likely also missing. Well, technically, my first roll, <laughs> I was able to hit in the head, but my gun would have exploded. Yeah. And then hit everybody around you in the head. Mm, no, wait, what? Maybe... No, what page really is the thing for his weapon? All right, so where'd you hit? It's in a different. Just it's again. not the core book. It's it's in one of the other books. Yeah, I remember that. Is it under the chapter or battle rights? One of those. Rise I think battle. it's yeah, rights of battle. battle. Yeah. Where's that hit? This is fifty-seven. Chest. <laughs> Guys, didn't I don't think I can launch? hit him in the head. Hang on, didn't we bring rocket launchers? You, this is—is is this melta gun? You said yes, melta? we did. Yeah, yes, it okay. is. So it's actually lost armor when you hit the first time. What was the damage the first time? Oh, sweet. I forgot yeah. that. That's what that does. So uh, Twenty-nine, yeah, was... thirty-one. So it has no armor. So it's dead. I think it's dead. I think you. But you were it. removing armor based on the penetration value before. I, I am. Yeah, it has 56. So, oh, yeah, yeah, 56. Oh, well, then you so just that's lowered by 30 chest. for the first two hits. And then the second two hits lower it by an additional 30 in addition to the damage they would be doing. Well, by the way, that, 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 that thing's got a blast of two. So anything within... Oh, let's see, minus two meters of it takes... I'm damage. looking at the description of the weapon. It doesn't have anything about rolling 100. It only yeah. has about having five degrees of failure. Yeah, that's why I was like, let me pull that back up. Oh, I thought, okay. That one, that one doesn't have a degree of failure. If I thought, so the third shot, well, there's still like a fail condition on it, though. Yeah, I third... don't think there is. No, there, yeah, there that was. One... We read it. Uh, firestorm multi multi. I'm just going back up. If an attack roll using a firestorm mil uh, multi multi fails by five or more levels, the weapon flares out, dealing damage equal to the number of charges left. And if you can assert to an area equal to the weapon's blast radius. Oh god, we'd all just die. Wait, equal to the weapon's blast radius, you said? Yeah. It's two. Oh. It's just We're fine. <laughs> it was just yeah, it's, but he wouldn't. He'd be dead immediately. All the remaining shots. I have <laughs> ninety-five rounds. Okay, so it, it... <laughs> that's why you don't belt feed those. So you you dropped it quite significantly. You just see in the distance something smoldering. But it it's still up. So you did quite a bit of damage, actually. I just did the math. Wow. So the his second two would have dropped at 60. So he would have no more armor. And right. the 25 and 33 that he got again yep. still didn't kill it. Nope. We have rockets. Nice. Well, at this yep. point, anyone can hit the center torso and hurt him. Yep. I, I, marked, I, I marked in the blue thing where his armor is taken down. So... Yeah, somewhere out there. Like we can see it. <laughs> no, no, you're you're just firing blindly where they're at. So that's so you actually see a smoldering. Thing One would the think the glowing slag of his armor would give away his location. It yeah, it does. That's why he's able to hit it more. So he got more accurate as you saw this rolls here. Okay, who else is left? Vero or Smite. Yeah, I still have to roll. So what am I going up against? Red knots? What you you see a giant glowing one. Now, so right. like, you oh, yeah. won't you? take you won't take a penalty on hitting it. All right, courtesy, courtesy to the Dominego. Yeah, he yeah. just wanted, it hit something. It's like I'll hit something. I'm going to fire a. Well, is it dead? That's the question. No, no, right. it is very much up. You see it and moving. There's another one. And you see it just kind of like charging up. You hear you hear a ratcheting of a chain gun. I'm. Oh. Fuck me. I'm I'm going to uh, take aim at it with my Soundstrike missile launcher having a crack missile loaded. 
So okay. what's the modifier on the two hit roll? It's a 250 meter range. They're within okay. range. They're within range. Just fire it. <laughs> Just fire it. What's yeah. modifier? Right. You can see where he's at. No, no, you have this. You get a you get a bonus, don't you? Plus 20. Yeah, I guess. I think you get a bonus or half. I it was well, I thought it's 100. Meters. If it's 150 meters. Yeah, then it's not quite. That's average. more than 250. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, more yeah. than. You can average, move. I believe, was just plus 10 to hit. It was only plus 20 if you were shooting at like full auto or something. Got it. Okay, so okay. plus 10 then. If oh you're my god. If you're shooting semi auto, then it's plus 10. I'm fate pointing that. Fuck that. Did you add your plus? <laughs> did you add your plus? Oh, you did. Okay. Yeah, you don't want right, to waste a missile. Rolled a 75. Yeah, you don't want to waste a missile here. Yeah. Wait. What did you roll with a plus fifteen? No. I don't think he did. So that would have been the, the, the additional plus fifteen because he's a space marine. He did. Oh he yeah. Did our target link. Yeah. So that would have been a success right there. Yeah. So you that's a success. Uh, one your damage success, in fact. Okay. Well, in that case, I don't use a fate point, and yeah. I'm gonna do a damage roll. Do 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 do. Do, do, do. Where is it? Here we go. All right, thirty-three giant, damage. You see, Ten pen. Giant, you see a giant explosion on his chest. You see Pacow. it's still smoking and charging its gun still. Holy oh, but shit. you have a righteous fury. I yes. do have a righteous fury. I don't think you can righteous fury a missile, missile launcher. launcher. Where you don't you have to reload it each time? I don't remember. Uh, that's yeah, I take, it takes single this, fires. Doesn't is the it, sound strike have multiple things? Yeah. There's one with a clip, and there's one where it's individuals. I just don't remember which All one. All right, well, which what's one the, do we what's have? The clips, what's the clip size in that? Uh, I am scrolling to try and find. What can you say shits and giggles? You yeah, have four missiles. Uh, yeah, that sounds about right, to be honest. It, do that. Uh, you're not using the armor bane, are you? It's a sound strike missile, aren't you? Poco, you're saying I have multiple missiles? Yeah. We'll just say you got the one with four slots. The one I'm seeing The sound pattern overcomes single. the single capacity of the launch tube by attaching a special missile rack and autoloader to a backpack power unit, so it has multiple rockets inside of it. Yeah. There you go. Do Fire I need again. another two hit roll? Yes. With the same modifiers as before, so it's going to be a plus 25. Yeah. Got it. Not a plus 10, but a plus 25. All right, and you that got hits. Him again. And, and a clip is uh, four, by the Oh, that's in the head, though. It is in the head, isn't it? Ow. Well, that's it's, unfortunate. It's still up, though, but yes. It's because he hit him in the head. It's smoking. It's smoking now we real get a bad. Headshot? Are you kidding? Oh, it hit in the head? Yes. Yeah, it was a headshot. Oh. And then it's yeah. not the full 29. Nope. Is it? What would okay, it be? So, so it's head. Let's see. Ten pen. So he has ten pen, so his head is forty one. Oh, no damage. Oh boo. you see it bounce off, basically. It <laughs> is a blast weapon though. It is also an armor penetrator, right? Yeah, he's using an armor penetrator. Blast now. one, so one meter. I will be right back. I'll minus ten off the head with that. He's his minus torso within one meter. No. Oh, actually, That's yeah, it would be. It would be, actually. Never mind, derp. He's yeah. got over a meter long, Nick. No. <laughs> yeah, but this day, it's... Uh, Sorry, I'm, I'm thinking sure that goes through. It could have hit him on the top of the head if he's got a meter long head. <laughs> yeah, but you see it, like, ricochet. Pink. Deal damage to the armor. Damn. But I'll give you some of the damage. You said splash damage, so... Yep. I'll give you nine. I'll give you nine damage. Hang on. Yeah. So, so some of it goes a little bit. Uh, anyone else? The thing is smoking heavily, by the way. The you surprise round. I think that's everybody's gone. Okay. Did everyone yep. roll? We're done with the did surprise round. Did you add the pen of ten for the? Wait, did you add the pen of ten for the missile? I did. It's it. Oh, okay. He has forty-one on the head. Oh, Jesus. Yep. Yeah. It's a. It's a. It's a dreadnought. Pro. Your your guy. Vaguely knew what it was, but you didn't really scrutinize or anything. You saw it was a no, I didn't. That's what archaic, yeah. Oh, 
Okay, your 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 guy wait, does remember these during the war uh, to be a early prototype of like contemptors. So, oh yeah, so it's it's still just as dangerous as a later version, but they're equipped with chain guns and not the the cannons. So. No, uh, no void shields. Excellent. No void shields of of anything you know of. So they don't have any BS on them. They just have armor, straight armor. But they're very deadly. Still have claws. I'm gonna on, relay on the this left to, and a uh, chain gun on the right. I'm gonna relay this to the party. Uh, now that I'm actually remembering that uh, these are basically the prototypes of Contemptor dreadnoughts. Are they as maneuverable as contemptors, or are they like the very bulky and slow, from what you recall? Okay, so less maneuverable. Yeah, contemptors. they're gonna, they're going to be marching up towards you in line formation. You know, they're they're attacked. They'll be marching in line formation and chain gunning you guys down. It's kind of like a volley of of lead you're about to receive. Okay, uh, I would then recommend to whoever is up here that they seal the door in the meantime, so we can get to the cover. Because I don't think we all want to get shot at with a chain gun. Yeah, no, uh, a, a big don't. chain gun. Big, big chain gun. So rotor guns, basically. Uh, yeah. Oh boy. Uh, which are, yeah, they're like heavier caliber than the uh, uh, bolt guns. That would sting a little bit. Hundred, if I recall, they're like hundred caliber bolt guns. The old ones were fifty-five. The current ones are point seven five. Or sorry, seven five. So. 100 caliber, Jesus fucking Christ. The bolt gun you're holding is 75. Oh. The turret one I'm using is .60. Well, so 60. Got it. Well, since I'm going last, I'm going to go change the living laundry. We'll be right back. Oh. All right. Uh, <laughs> well, I guess it's probably going to be me that closes the door. <clears throat> yep, it's your go. I, if you guys want, I could jet back over and grab it, and you guys can just run. Do you, uh, real quick, do we want to seal the door and pull back to a more defensive location, or do we want to just seal the door and wait here and ambush them as they come through? We need to get to the psychers as close as fast as possible, and they're very slow. We can probably outrun them. I have Eric, an idea. Your call with your mission, unless uh, Virlu has a better idea. I think he just went AFK. Yeah, he just went AFK. I, yeah, I was right, going to so say, I have an I'm idea. Um, you could you could pick up Moss character, throw him at the door. Uh, just jet pack <laughs> yeah. It's much safer. Yeah, yeah. true. I'll, I probably I could definitely throw Moss character, but... Yeah. Um, Eric, ladies, Technically, your... the jetpack will allow, allow me to land from any height or throw. <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I'll allow it if, if you're willing, willing to do it. Well, it is your turn, so, like, that's kind yeah, of I mean, I can saying. just throw him and just, like... <laughs> your guy, your guy's I can also hand, do that as well. Yeah, your guy's yeah. hand is as big as him now. So. <laughs> yeah. <It's> pretty big. <laughs> A I'm big chungus. Kind of <laughs> but right. as you do that, if you're going to do that, do a willpower save as well. Yeah, I was like, hey, I feel like this Ed would be the suit. I was going to say uh, Eric Lady's call anyways, though. Try and ambush them or just seal the door also, and run. Also, do a willpower save now that I'm thinking about it because your suit, you have a inkling it wants to grab that guy's skull and rip it off. You just feel it in the machine spirit. What was uh, Let me pull up what that roll was again, or the thing was again. Uh, traits? Yeah, put it on traits, Steam. Yeah, it's going to be a minus 30. So whatever you're minus thirty, and then your bonuses. And this will be if it does do it, it'll be a free action. So it's your big. I don't know. I'm trying to remember what the roll was. What it was last time. The modifier. Was, uh, the thirty from Moss character, thirty from your thing. Just thirty. So you, yeah, it should be thirty. So you would have a plus sixty. So you'd be you would have a plus thirty then. Yeah. I don't know what this roll is. So your Where's suit. Success? Yeah, it's success. So your suit. You see it kind of, its hand kind of inch towards it, and then you're able to pull it back towards you. 
Eric, Lady, seal the door and run or set up an ambush? Uh, seal the door and run. Very we well. Time for this. <laughs> that and they'll have already alerted anyone up ahead that we're here, so finishing them is somewhat pointless. I'm going to, what, strength? Dexterity? Agility? You picking him up? So you're uh, picking him are you picking yeah. up moss character? Okay. Uh, so again, minus 30 and we'll put our save because it's wanting to crush the weakling. And then it just had back. willpower. There we go. No, that was willpower to, from you taking. No, the no, 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 no. I was talking to myself. I'm like, I just, oh, okay. I'm just staring at, it. I'm, I'm staring at a tiny laptop screen as opposed to my large monitors. And so I'm like, where the hell is it? Got it. So moth, hopefully he doesn't fail and crush you. It's good. Because- so he just you just pick him up daintily, threat strength check, and you toss him. Um, uh, his button on the left to the right side. So you would toss him. What what is it? Uh, strength modifier and then what's the times the what was the throws again? I have no idea. Well, let's just say you toss him all there. You're strong enough. You toss him all over there. We ain't gonna complicate it. <laughs> Pick light thing up, throw light thing. And then Moth, you gotta do your jetpack thing. Say so Moth has catfall, doesn't he? Uh, yeah, but he's being tossed. He has to slow his descent here. Or else he's gonna go prone immediately. I uh, say I th- he has a thing where he can just st- he just stands up. True, but he has that that had to be on his turn then. Actually it's a free action, so I could just get up whenever. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah, I say because I have the exact same perk. I think you only do free actions still only on your turn, but yes. Oh. One would assume free would be any time. No, that's a reaction. Right. Yeah. So free action is on your turn. A reaction. Gotcha. Yeah. Well, uh, I got a two point one success. So. So you land. So and you push the button. Uh, and then we slowly begin the uh, march away from the door. You mean we quickly begin the run away from the door? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, let's see. So that was your turn. Domingus, go. Can I make my half move away? Yeah, go for it. Okay. Uh, I'm presuming just half, yeah, half move since I just threw him so I can make it to the threshold of this next door. Maybe. There we go. All right. I'm good. Are you... I... Okay, let's say. Go ahead. I run. <laughs> I end my turn. <laughs> okay, Brasara. Go. Okay, jetpack turns over. Okay, it is now their turn. Someone seal the second door behind us, please. When everyone left, right? Ooh. Hello there. Hey, look, it's a furry. Ah, uh, it's funny. So it's going to I feel fight. like I'm so close that I'm going to just slap it in the face. <laughs> right. Just so open hand attack. slapping with your... going to attack you. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, do you have anything to counter it? Quick, smack it out of the nose and tell it no. <laughs> yeah, I'll, boop uh, is snoot or boop I'll is snoot. It. Either one. Whichever is higher, if you can dodge or parry with uh, well, melee you can only weapon. parry if you have a melee weapon in hand. Yeah, and it's a creature. Yeah, I'll dodge is, uh... Any modifiers for dodging? Don't think so. No. Not unless you have modifiers for dodging. You dodged it. Okay, and then here comes the second one. I can't dodge that one. Unless and I pull out my sword. And it, it too is going to bite bite at you. I do have a sword. Is it in your hand? Or was your gun in your hand? It down in my hand, unfortunately. It bites you. Just gonna have a bayonet. Owie. Ow. Instead of a bayonet now in the multi melter. Holy 42. shit. That's a lot 40, of damage. 42. Where does it hit you? Center mass? 42 Wait. is center mass. Yeah, 42 is center mass. Yeah. Okay, pen of 10, 47 damage. I have pen of 21. 
Or I have uh, armor of 21. So you have an armor of 10 now. So you mm. just took 37 27. damage. Are you still alive? 36. I think I have a hole in my body. So uh, if you have 20 wounds, how many wounds do you have? 21. All right. So 21. Uh, what is it? Well, I have total wounds of 21. I didn't get hit until now. Right. Right. We're calculating how much... Probably how much critical damage you're going to be 16, taking here. 16, 8. 8 critical damage. Oh. Now... So that's four that... on the chart. No, 16 is uh, 8 on the chart. So he's going to be taking oh. 16 critical damage and it's 8 Oh, he took 16 chart. critical damage. Oh, 8 on the chart? He may just be dead. Yeah. Well, if it's his torso, he might still be alive. Maybe. It, it's a pretty high number, though. All right, where do Usually we anything about seven and above is pretty much dead. Uh, he doesn't dead. He has that that organ that that sustains him. I'm no, he has sixteen critical damage. Well, eight critical damage. Is it well, actually he... eight critical damage or sixteen critical damage? Okay, so he took eight sixteen. On the table. We reduce it to eight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So he's got sixteen critical damage, eight on the chart. So it's not I'm four looking... on the chart. It's eight on the chart. I'm looking up the chart as we speak. Oh my god. Really? Like nine this and ten bullshit on Chester, again? Dad. Someone can fade point at me, he just he can just go down. Take or I nine. or I can re roll the the get the the bite. My uh something's been going on with my fucking Do you want to fade is, point fade point the attack? The I don't have a fade point anymore. No no no, He's but someone else mine. can so you want to take one of mine. I have marked. I, uh, there you go. Now you have one more. Okay. So it's so... rending damage to the body. Eight. Not dead. If it was nine, he'd be dead. Okay, so I'm going to reroll the attack. Since... And it's going to be minus ten since you guys use the fate point. It's still a hit. Okay, Blue but ER the damage... Was not... Okay, there's one... One less. <laughs> Don't round it up, so it doesn't change anything. 26. It's a what different is... body part, though. Oh. Where's 26 hit? 26. That's an arm? Yeah, it's definitely an arm. So that's going to be worse. Left arm. Uh, yeah, you're probably going to lose your left arm. Mm. Hold up. I Maybe got not. 22. Wait, why do I have 22 armor versus at the arms and not... And I have body 21. Your shield? Did you have a shield? No. Your body should be more than 21 if your arms are 22. Your armor should be, yeah, yeah the chest should be 40. So if no. that's 40. What? No, what not 40. No. It's not going to be 40. Not 40. Not 40. I'm sorry, I'm thinking of my guys. I wish like, we had 40 armor. To, to give you, you an idea. The armor that you have, I think. I don't think anyone here would have a different armor rating except for... Uh, uh, the, we were getting armor. customized armor by Tesseract. Characters. Yeah, that's true. So Our real quick, everyone, everyone here has unique armor. Did, Very real quick, did, did, did you, question: Do did, did you Actually, modify no, your arm, armor during the session at all, or did you get a chance to? I did. I got okay. new armor set if I remember correctly. Right. Can you show us the armor values? Can you? Yeah. Screenshot it. Because if the chest is a better area to get hit by, then just take the chest shot. Why do you have oh. nine on the body? Oh, yeah. Uh, I think losing your arm is better. You should not have nine on the body. That's wrong. Yeah, wrong as hell. Because if he takes uh, an eight on the critical chart for the chess, uh, he makes a toughness test, and if he fails, he dies. If he passes, he permanently loses 1d10 from his toughness. Oof. Whereas the other one on his arm makes a toughness test or die. Uh, and if you pass, he loses an arm, but he doesn't permanently lose, t uh, lose toughness. So, dude, your body should be like 14, not 9. Want, yeah. I'm trying to look at the, like, if since he had armor modified for him, I'm trying to look for the stats in the. Yeah, in sorry. The uh, what's his character's name again? Dominego Cast. Dominego. 
12, 10. Yeah, you should have 10, 12 on the chest and like 10 everywhere around it. Presuming you've got Mark 7 as your default. No, he has a different armor. Uh, according different to armor. this, he has a... Where is it? Mark 6 Corvus pattern power armor? No, Aquila pattern power armor. Well, no, that's why I was asking. I was asking like which mark he has because they're all different. Yeah, I'm still searching it for must be a it different through. one then. Because I'm yeah. all the way I'm all the way back when we were rolling for the original rolls for stuff. Yeah, just, just 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 give him twelve. I, I, I screenshotted the, the thing in the Death Watch channel. Yeah, that's just give him oh, okay. yeah, twelve chest. So that might not you might not be outright dead with twelve on the chest. Well that makes it twenty four armor then. Okay. So what what would your damage be then if you took that forty seven to the chest? Let's see. So that'd be fourteen minus the forty seven, so that'd be twenty three damage in total. Thirty three, ten minus twenty one, twelve. Uh, six. He would need to roll six on the chart on the chart. Not much critical damage then. Wait, what? If you took twenty three, no, he'd be Hold taking twenty three damage. So he should be like at a one on the chart. Twenty three. So hold on. So he has forty-seven damage with pin ten, right? So he has twenty-four right. armor on the chest. Uh, minus ten, that's fourteen armor. Forty-seven yeah. minus fourteen is thirty-three. Ah, uh, thirty-three, not twenty-three. Yep. Thirty-three minus twenty-one is twelve. That's okay. that fills up his wounds. Yeah. Yep. yep. So and then okay. twelve so divided by two is six. Yeah. Yeah. So six on the chest is better than six on the arm. Uh. Well, they're they're both kind of the same at that point. And how much but, critical damage that is? Six. Well, it's 12 critical damage, but it's six on the chart. Uh, let me just check how the talent works exactly. The hardy talent. Wait one moment. Because it's either we take half the damage for mm. critical damage, or we just half the result on the chart. And I think we just half the result. Yeah, on the it's chart. half the result on the Fruit. chart, not half the damage. Trunk red, trunk red, trunk red. But either way, six on the chart for the body for rending. Uh, a mighty attack takes a sizable chunk out of the target and knocks him to the ground as he clutches the oozing wounds, streaking in pain. You are prone and take 1d10 levels of fatigue, but that's it. Yep. And do a strength check because it's trying to latch on you. No, it actually 1D. takes less damage. It actually just takes less damage according to the rules. Okay, so he has six critical damage then. Yeah. I was trying to grapple. Let me see. Let me, let me do the grapple. Uh, roll 1d10 for fatigue. Yes, 1d10 levels of fatigue. So you have two mm -hmm. levels of fatigue. Where the heck is the fatigue chart? It's on your movement. Your fatigue is tracked where your movement stats are located. Oh, is that yeah. wrangling? Is wrangling? What is wrangling? Is that is that have to deal with? Wrangling, yeah. I think it's, it's like animal. Handle, handle. Handle it. Okay. Got it. But now it's trying to. <laughs> um. Wait. A I don't have a text box for fatigue. Uh, you I've have, been using uh, the threshold, and the next to it is current and a uh, Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, on the right oh, side yeah. of threshold. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Right where it says current. I get, so I guess if it. you ever meet your threshold, you pass out. Right. And gra grappling Good. is that a strength check? Is that what it is? Because it's biting and grapples. And I'm guessing no modifiers. Uh. For a strength test. Uh, if if it's a grapple check. Well, you do. You have a, a plus two because of your armor. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a strength check. If I'm right, because I don't. It sounds like it would be strength or maybe acrobatics to get out of it. I think I think it's plus two. Could also be dodge. Right. You've already dodged. And that's well, yeah. True. yeah. You're just trying to prevent him from grappling on you. So and so you just would, be, uh, just strength or acrobatics, I would say. Yeah, acrobatics is trained, so you got to be trained to use it. So then probably just a raw strength, strength check. Just draw strength, strength. Yep, just beat a strength check, and you do. So he doesn't nice. grapple on you, because he was going to... Yeah, it'd be a bad day for you, man. 
They're dragons, so he's going to breathe fire in your wound and carterize it for you. No, he would drag you off in the hole. <laughs> Beerlo, go. Oh, what? Oh, yeah. Keep uh, right there. All right. So I'm going to turn Man. around, and I see these, what are these, these hellhounds? Which one of them is the most injured of the two? Or do we not know? Neither. N neither one of these has been hit. Oh, okay. All right. So yeah, they just showed up. it was their turn. They showed up and started attacking us. I'm gonna attack the guy on the left, and mm -hmm. I'm going to shoot at him with my stalker bolt gun using vengeance rounds. You're also firing into melee, so just be careful. Okay. I am prone, So I'm within half distance, so that's plus 20. Firing into melee is what, minus 10? Minus, I think it was minus 20, firing into melee. Minus 20? Okay. Uh, let me check. Oh. <coughs> I've lost my pants on an unrelated note. Not you. Are you going to find him? I'm trying to. Uh, right, I'm just going to go minus, minus nothing, or plus nothing. Minus half. 20. Uh, melee is a minus 20. Yeah. Okay. Uh, about so 50 be... minutes. Yeah, 50 minutes. I got to head up for fighter practice. That's definitely so hard. it does hit. Okay. Do you do your damage? All right. 13 explosive. And it is felling. And felling of one means I ignore one of the target's unnatural toughness bonus. Yes. It doesn't got it. Doesn't got any, but so uh, all right, it does have some, but it's whatever. It doesn't have any armor with all that right. pen nine, so it doesn't exist to you. Got it. Um. Okay. Well, he takes thirteen damage, I guess, if he has no yep. armor. Bet to you, no. That pen nine, nope, doesn't exist. Was that a like single single shot, or is that like multiple multiple shots? I believe the stalker bolt gun is a semi-automatic only. I could be wrong. Well, semi-auto means you have multiple shots. Oh. Because you have um, single shot, semi auto, and full auto. So you have S or a number, and then S, there's also a burst firing, other number. and then a full auto. Okay, S well, means it's S. single shot only. Yeah, I've got S on mine then. Okay, so then it's just a single shot. Yep. Bang, bang. Or rather, okay. bang. Bang. Okay, uh, Eric, ladies, go. <clears throat> All right, that was my turn. Karnoff, go. Vroom, 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 as they say. <laughs> uh, hello there. Uh, hold on, wait. Oh, my my thing went. Thank you, thank you, Road Twenty. Okay, uh, back to the thing. Uh, I'm gonna do a, an all-out attack because let me let me let me. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I'm going to do an all out attack, which gives me another plus 20. There you go. I hit. I'd hope so with that much. Yes. Uh, I think I. No. Nothing happens. Oh, yes. No. Something does happen because I think that gives me an ability to use shocking. What was it? No, hammer blow. Oh wait, no, but don't, we don't, hammer we don't need that. Hammer blow was the second one. Was it yeah. a different kind of attack? Uh, hammer blow is the same as an all-out attack. It's just a modified ah. all-out attack. Uh, they don't really have any penetration uh, armor, should I say? So that doesn't matter. Um, I do have a talent called Death from Above, which, since I just used a jetpack, that gives me an ability to do more damage based on the amount of successes I had on the attack so that's going to be one and they have no armor this is what's gonna this is what they're this one's gonna take in damage it's dead uh you see it vaporize sure like that's gonna be it that's just gonna be a normal uh, yeah that's just gonna be a normal no you know what no 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 that's not going to be all of it. I'm going to do an acrobatics test. See if I pass it. 
Yeah, because Dominicus is freaking hurt, so you probably want to get these dogs off him. Yeah, I move up to this guy, and I do a second all-out attack, because that's part of my talent, which allows me to do two all-out attacks. It's a, what is it, Fury of Blows, or something like that? Yeah, whatever. Uh, same modifier, I think. No, because I don't, I'm not really charging right now. I'm just moving. So that's going to be this. Still hits. Uh, it's not a death from above. Well, yeah, it's not really a death from above. It's not a charge. Um, so I'm going to do this amount of damage to it. It is hurting. All right, then let's just do another one. You see, it's barely in this corporeal world with that strike. Oh, I, I, I'm supposed to do an, an attack again because that's like yep. which which is needed. Uh, but uh, we'll just go with like just this is the damage I would deal, and the attack is super dead. The same. So yeah. Sweet. You just probably saved Dominagus' life there. How much life do you have, Dominagus? Did you, you get hit with 46? Like he took critical, critical wounds, damage. my guy. Yeah, I will be I'm, medicating. He doesn't I'm have any wounds left. I'm screaming in pain. I will be medicating you the next turn. Please do. I brought, I brought medicine. I brought holy healing. How much damage did you take? 33, you said? Something. It, he filled his wounds, and he has six on the critical table. I think he got it. Got six on the. Yeah. Yep. I can heal four of your critical wounds. Holy shit! Um, yeah, what I gotta look up what Medicaid shit can do, but I also have medicine. However, I'll be taking twenty damage to do that myself. So, Ooh, oh, maybe, maybe don't do that. <laughs> well, it can be Medicaid. Normal sure. damage. I yeah. take twenty normal damage. Which Yay. is less than I have more wounds than he does. I got twenty three total, so I can take that, and it'll remove critical wounds off of him. So, and do probably a, a good choice, right? Uh, do a willpower save before you make any moves. All of us, or just just keep her. Hmm? Oh, sorry, I didn't realize it was my turn. I thought we were. Nope, Carnoth went. We're just. Oh, we're still in turn order. Fuck, it's yeah, willpower save. Oh, absolutely. All right. Yeah, there's still like a couple of guys over here. Ah, they're around the corner. Her, I, I count four guys. And you guys yeah, hear people. you guys hear commotion coming down this hallway. All right, I passed the willpower test. Uh, Sweet. Uh, see if I think I put okay. Page one seventy four. One second. I'm trying to pull, uh, pull up some of the medicines that I brought with me for their. Uh, Those warhounds. You have a. You have a. You took fatigue. Yeah. Are you conscious or unconscious? I'm conscious, screaming in pain. Yep. Ah, cool. Then we're just gonna use a. Well, actually, you have pain suppressant in your armor. I'm presuming you didn't use it. Can I move past him, stabbing him with a pain suppressant? Well, if he has it in his armor, he can just do it by himself, I think. Yeah, so he has some in his armor. We could give him a double dose. I don't see anything here about ill effects for double doses. Uh, I, there is, yeah, so you carry 1d10 in your, sorry, you can ignore critical effects for 1d10. That's in your armor. Your armor has a set amount of uh, injections, depending on whatever version armor you have. Uh, but if you didn't like quote pat succeed that I could just give you another dose as you go by and then just give you a med kit. Or I can go and just straight up try and heal you. Probably just straight up and heal me. I can yep. also straight up remove four critical wounds from you. He is also hardly badly hurt. Or like yeah. what is it like heavily That's wounded? Exactly. Give him the med kit. Do you guys want me to stop it straight in front of him and just focus on him? We got this, I think. We might, we might want to keep the area safe first. Okay, so I'm going to move past and 
If Boko's good with that, I'm just going to stab you with a pain suppression, and then I'll take up a defensive position in front of you. Yeah. Okay. You're going to take... Uh, did, you get, did you get my message there, Dominigus? Uh, you sent that to me. Oh, I should have sent that to everyone. We got it. Oh, no, 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 everyone it. sees it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, geez. Oh yikes! <laughs> okay, we got a five here. points of corruption. Wonderful. Okay, so Oof. I'm gonna do two things then. Let me. That's not good. It'll be fine. It'll buff. <laughs> Maybe one point. Well, it's gonna take a long time to buff out. Okay, so I can't move close enough to fully engage unless I run, and I'm not gonna do that. So I'm gonna take a defensive stance uh, over with him. And I'm going to put all of my effort into him. So first, I'm going to use a pain suppressor. Uh, so I'm just going to roll a 1d10. Or do you want to roll the 1d10 since it's being used on you? Buckets acquired. Engage. Firing. Yep, go ahead. Okay, that is 10 points of your critical gone. Nice. Wow, you just healed big... all of his critical damage. That so... is the pain suppressant. Uh, so it's a, it's supposed to be a plus 10, but I have the Medicaid training, so it's not. So I got plus, so I have six critical damage, so does that roll into wounds? It's it just critical damage. Yeah, it's just, it just does critical damage. Uh, and then it would be just medical. Uh, ah, fuck. I gotta find the page I put that one on. One second. If you don't mind, I don't, I remember we wrote down what you said the medical the medical kits were, and I don't remember where I put that. Uh, should, that have been, was should have been in journals, I imagine. Hmm. Should have been under the journals, I imagine. Let me check. So we wrote down all your stuff you guys had. Because I brought a bunch of st like the other stuff. I brought repair uh, repair cement, paint suppressants, rusts. Yeah, most forces might have it. No, no, I didn't put anything in there. Well, I didn't put anything in there. Or I could just use uh, Medicaid and just try and. I think it was a... right. Well, the medical kits. I think it was a one d ten healing. Something one d like ten. Okay. Yeah. Plus uh, any of my Plus Medicaid. probably your Medicaid. Yeah, Medicaid. I'm going to use my Medicaid on that. Give me one second to find where the f lap that is. Okay. Okay, so two degrees of success, so I'll roll 1d10 plus two. Yep. Okay. Right. Twelve. There you go. You've got twelve health, and I am going to be taking a straight up stance, uh, yep. blocking anything coming from uh, this direction so, with the shield and my body. There you oh, go. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, brother. Now is not the time to die. That yeah. comes later. And how much? Yeah, how much she took? What five pin on the armor? Or, yeah, yeah. Um, I can't one. use repair cement on this turn. I don't think that would make sense. Right. But next turn, or if he wants, he could probably grab. I it from could probably room. just I, use my own cement. Yeah. If you brought some, yeah. Yeah, because you get minus well, five. Well, standard issue. Because, yeah, you're minus five on your torso. By the way, where whoever used the fate point, it's back to you. I don't think you used it. So. Very well. Uh, uh Dominagus. Go yeah. right. Yeah. Uh, if if you want to delay you. your turn, I can remove some of those critical wounds for you permanently. Do you want the turret to go? Yeah, turret. Yeah, yeah. I forgot. Go ahead, fire the turret. Sorry, do your thing. Your turret gets a free shooting. It helps if I hit the right. T I hate that this whole thing doesn't. The whole character page doesn't fit on my uh, laptop screen. It's very weird. Can't you like do? You can just zoom out. Just do. Uh, oh yeah, there it is. Yeah, control mouse wheel it. might work. Or control minus equals. The turret is not going to hit. I don't think. It's control control mouse wheel yep. is probably easier. Well, he's on the laptop. That's going to be harder. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, true. 
All yep. right, uh, it's whoever's turn next. Yep. Uh, oops, sorry, dummy, dominate go. How far can I like just prone move? Is that a half move? I think so. I think it's a full move action, but you move your half speed. Half move, so All eight. Right. Uh, where's my measuring? To be fair, you're fully blocked and shielded by me right now. And the wall, too. Yeah, you're Those, much better off just standing up. Unless they throw a grenade. There's they, a shield in front of them. Right, because so those All dogs right. came around the corner and surprised them and got them, so... <laughs> yeah, I'm physically holding a shield, so even if a grenade goes off, it's it, she should be fine. Like, they, Yeah, they also, I'm sure, then, you know, they move stupid fast, so... Yeah, then I stand them. up and uh, recollect what just happened. Yeah, or I stand up and apply the uh, cement. Yeah, they would have to move like that to get to him. Yeah. Will that, will that be okay, Moth? Will you still be able to use your power, healing nope. powers? I need to touch you, not your armor. So he can move up and touch you? Yeah. Just and since we, we, we have the same initiative, so... Yeah, can we move at the paper. same time, Moko? You, you can go first, and then he can go, since you have 13. So go ahead. Do you want to do that? Yeah, just... Yeah. All right. Walk up to you, rub my hands together all Mr. Miyagi style and slap your wound. And four critical wounds are gone. Nice. All wounds gone. Four, four critical wounds. wounds are gone. He doesn't have any critical wounds. His critical wounds are already yeah. healed. I you can't. Can... Wait, how? You can't heal critical wounds unless you take time. Fucking paint spray. You can, you can ignore them, but they're still there. No, no, eh. no, no. Uh, Krom healed them. You, no, you can't heal critical wounds. Oh. That's the whole point. I see. Critical wounds are permanent. You need bed rest to heal those. Close enough. All right, so He's critical there. wounds are now gone. Yep. Either way, they're gone. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah. yeah they're you gone. had six, didn't you? Yeah. I can only heal four. You still have two. Medkit? Medkits can't heal critical. They can't? I only use wounds. No. Well, okay. he heals normal wounds. Well, then, he's got two. And he's got 12 health. Then I cough up a bunch of blood. And then my uh, armor triggers, funnily enough. Sweet. It's actually got a med kit in it. Okay. And then is your turnover, Moth? Uh, yep. Dominagus, go. I stand up and apply the cement paste thing. Is that your whole turn? Yeah. All right. I'm going to switch over to the bad guys. And I got to go pee. I'll be right back. Again, damn. Someone had too much coffee. Yeah. Speaking of, BRB, going to grab some coffee. That is a good idea. I'll go grab some too. So how how bad your character looking now? I think he has like twelve HP and two critical. I have nine current wounds and two critical. Okay. Like That's twenty one minus twelve. Yeah. Mm. Okay. So you're looking a lot better than you were. Okay, so let's see. They're shooting at the wall, the door. Here, I'll set up a token to represent the door's health. Oh. I just thought <laughs> I just thought about something. <laughs> uh, yeah. Actually, I, I gotta do the the hit right. Okay, so the article. So, Karnoff, if I say duck, I would recommend ducking. I did do an all out attack. I don't think I can dodge. Okay. Three. Um. Let me, I don't let me check. Know what's on the front of my Five. shield? I'm aware of what's in front of your shield, yes. 
Yeah. And then the and other uh, one was six, one, two. Three. If they get to here, they're in range. Yeah. <laughs> Who are they shooting at? Jesus. The, the, door. The, the door. The door. The door. The oh, okay. Right. So I'm just, I, I set up hell for the door, and I, I'm not telling you what it is, but uh, that door will eventually be breached. Yeah. Yeah. So. So anyone who hasn't moved through the door, move through the door. Yeah, move through the second door, like, time now, and someone seal it, please. Right. Yeah, I cannot dodge or parry. I can full prone. Yes, so yeah. if I say full prone, just full prone, please. Right now, or later? No, 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 if it comes to it. I should be able to give you at All least, right. like, a turn of, of notice, but, like, get out of the way if it comes Got to it. it. Oh, man. Uh, plus... Somewhere in here, there's the thing for all the damage for all the mines that's on the front of my shield. Oh, here we go. No, here we go. Oh, man, they might one tap the store. Nope, you guys are still good. Okay, minus 493 damage from that door. Oh, Jesus, Mary and Christ. That's a lot of damage. Yep. The door's still holding. You saw some bullets bust through here and there. Okay, I'm going to move some other guys. A pin on that. I'm back. What a miss. Uh, some of the bullets just came through from the door behind us. Everyone get on this side of the second door and seal it. Ooh, ooh, who wants a vortex grenade? Uh, Not my nope. work. <laughs> Yummy. I <laughs> like eating grenades for breakfast. Worst comes to worst, just yeet it down, down like... Uh, and then hit the other door? <laughs> yeah, well, then we need to run, because that thing teleports around. But, but, actually, no, that would get rid of the corridor in, entirely. But it could still keep coming towards us. Okay, so, Karnoth, you ready for a fight? I cannot um, parry or dodge, so let's go. Uh, I could do one thing. <laughs> so they're all, can. They are They saw what you did, so they're all just like, you can tell they're licking their lips and charging right at you. I yep. don't suppose we could detonate my shield and have him go prone. Uh, I think you used all your actions for him. Yeah. Think... Very well. Uh, <laughs> Good luck, I'd, bud. Yeah, otherwise I'd say... Yes. They, these are Chaos Berserkers. Are these? Ah, the Chainsword guys. All right. First guy fate point hit. to do the shield thing? Hmm? Maybe spend a Fate point to do the shield thing? Or... Could we? Swift Death Chainsword. Oh, boy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, uh, I forgot that fucking Heraclitus oh. was still holding my shield. Can I have my shield? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> All right, yeah, sorry. Yeah, 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 so I have your shield. So three get through. All right. Uh, let me just do the... There's a three. I wonder how many will go through. Oh, we well, should look at that. All of them go through. Uh, I can't spend Wait. all of my fate points and survive that, I do guess. You, can't you parry? Oh, you did not out attack. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Correct. I I had to save Dominego from those guys. Yeah, no, no, you're, you're gonna you're gonna spend all your fate points to turn those zeros to ones. Uh, I will give you one of my fate points. Is that? Uh, I I guess I can do that. Sure. I've got That's... another four. I can throw one at you too. Or you can force them to re-roll their attacks. Either way, you want to do it. I'll just use the use the the the. I'll just turn those zeros into ones. Okay. But like that will overload my shield essentially. Sure. So. Uh, you're lucky you're one taking 50 you're, damage though you're lucky more one more than 50 mid. One yeah mid. I am yeah <laughs> oh. all right, I, I, gave I spent you all of my fate points I, I, no I gave you one alright so I'm gonna have one yeah. point on me sure yeah okay and that's all the Virlo go alright um get on this side of that door whatever you do which side 
this side. All right. South. Done. Last one. Last one through. Seal that door. All right. That's a lot of fucking dudes down there, isn't it? Yeah, so take one out. Make um, it one less. Alright. I'm going to shoot at this guy right here with my Stalker bulk gun using vengeance rounds. You're shooting into combat and you're shooting past um, Prom's guy. The All last right. 20 for shooting at the guy in <clears throat> combat. Oh, you're over there? Is that where you're at? Yeah, he's shooting right here. He should be good for me. I'm okay, well within half not, range as well. You're good. You're good. You're good then. I thought you were behind him. I was like, oh, you're going to take a penalty for that one. Yeah, okay, no, so no modifier then. All right. Did you add your plus yeah, you 15? Hit. My plus what? Yeah, for being within half range. I did no, hit. for the uh, Tor Ballistic skill. He is dead. Hey, sweet. I did a thing, yeah. guys. Nice. Yippee, I did a thing. You get a plus ten and then a plus five to your ballistic, our ballistic and weapon skill for you had to do the hop of wood or whatever, the techno babble stuff. Uh does that trigger righteous fury? Can I fire yes. again? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh it's a new, another two hit roll. You are Wait, shoot, now you're shoot. shooting through me. So you're gonna Maybe take single a fire, but he still has a clip. Yeah, true. You're minus twenty through shooting through him. Oh damn it. I'm gonna fate point that. It'd be minus five anyways, not a minus 20, because you're not adding your plus 15 to the ballistic skill. That's All right. right. I'm going to fate point that. Uh, she said minus five. So plus and five. Plus, plus, plus five. five. Yeah. Total of plus five. All right. Plus five. Ayo. Okay. Nice. Nice. He is also dead. Damn. All right, then. I think he can parry two guys. The four guys was cutting it close, wasn't it? Okay. Uh, where did Eric go? Boop, and then uh, I ready in action to... Oh, God, there's more shit down here. Uh, and then I ready in action to close the door the moment whoever this guy is steps through it. Krom um. is already through the door. He's a big guy. Yeah. Oh. Who's, who's oh. this? Oh, then who's this? Oh, that's sorry. That that's was my old, old token. That's my old. Yeah. I say. Okay. All right. Uh, then I close oof. the door. I have no sight line for this new token, by the way. I just realized. Got it. Uh, let me. Let's see. Blah blah blah. That's why I've been like moving two tokens because I didn't have sight Got lines. Got it. Nope, still no sight lines. Yeah, give me a second. I'm trying to... Oh. The, the the app is being weird. I'm trying to do something. Night vision. What the? There we go. Did you have vision now? Yep. Okay, yeah, I couldn't see any of that. And I was like, "What? What? how are they seeing this shit? Nope, I updated your token too. Because that oh. is your, that is literally your token now. Yeah. The old Krom in black armor is gone. <laughs> now Krom wears whatever color this armor is. Red. Oh, perfect. Skulls Note to self, get some paint. Okay, and Karnoth, go. All right, since they are here, which is very good. They have some abilities too. Let me see if they're. They have some. Uh. Hmm. I don't think I can. Oh, actually, let's do it like this. I'm gonna hit one of them first. Uh. That's gonna be. Okay, so he gets yeah. plus four damage on the, those guys that successfully hit you. They get plus four damage next time they attack. Because they got blood for the blood god. Mm, okay. So uh, I'm going to hit the, the guy at the bottom. 
Oh. Attempt to. Wow. All right. I see how it is. You know what sucks? It's... Or sucks for me at least. And I forgot about it. They actually mm-hmm. have. It's called Blinding Speed. Korok gain. Or that these guys gain a second full action per turn. But for only melee combat only. You would have been super dead. I would have been super dead. Yes. All right. I can re-roll that as a part of a Blade Master talent at the uh, same penalties. Oh. <laughs> All right, that's not gonna hit anyone. Sure. Would you like a fate point? No, nah, it's okay. That that doesn't do anything. All right, so that one successfully hits. Uh, I'm gonna do an acrobatics check. Yeah, it's okay. Acrobatics. All right, never mind. I just stay where I am. You and I'm gonna. Go <laughs> what are we trying to do? Describe what you're trying to do. No, no, no. So acrobatics is oh, 95. So acrobatics is whenever I deal, like whenever I hit someone, regardless of whether. Wait, was it was it a successful? Or is it a normal? Oh, I think it's just a normal hit. If I hit someone, I can do an acrobatics test to move, yeah. and without them fighting, uh, without them uh, using attack to. opportunity. Yeah. Oh, so the attack opportunity you're saying? They don't. Uh, get it. We don't get it. It's just like a test if I can do it. It's like... Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. yeah. 95, so... you grab it's, like, it's like basically fail or pass. It doesn't really do anything okay. beyond that. Uh, got it. Just making sure, because I was like, I, I want to have fun here and knock you not, in not, not yet, not yet. Okay. All right. <laughs> and another one. I guess the bottom one. Okay, it's... All right. That's uh, gonna be the measure. Yeah, they're pretty good. Uh, so that is the orders turner. You were the last guy. You have a seven, right? Yep. Okay, so I guess uh, the keeper goes. Tyron, Tyvar, Karen, <laughs> Crom. You were right. You were right with the way you said Tyvar. Yeah, you're good. All right. Um. So receiving Vox traffic from Eric, ladies. I'm going to just body past uh, well, the black shield here and right, and I will save uh, minus thirty before you do anything else. Let me pull up this one. Sorry, this suit's fighting you <laughs> every step of the way. No, I know. <laughs> That's a success. That's a success, technically. Yeah. <laughs> that is the scariest damn thing I've seen in a while. <laughs> God <laughs> damn! I'm gonna. I gotta screenshot that. Oh, oh, the screenshotting thing only works within the small little... I'll take it later. Some of the I'll, screenshot. I'll screenshot it for you. Here we go. Thank you. All right, there are two people in front of me, and I'm about to attack at least one of them with three attacks. Uh, let me pull up my traits. All to right, make there sure you go. Them. It's in Death Watch chat. You're welcome. Oh, thank you, sir. All right, so... I'm going to start swinging at this dude right in front of me. Let me get the right tab. Dan's screenshot is better. It's more informative. And we it's say... also bigger. Also, yeah. could we reorder it so that Moth goes first? Moth? I don't know if he has. Yeah, oh, Moth. you mean the 12.9? You can just type your thing in. I already did, but I think... No, we, we can't move. It. The DM has to move people in turn order. Oh. So that's his head. There we go. Yeah, he's dead. Okay, I'm gonna use the other two attacks on the other guy if you don't mind, sir. Because they only, they only had the one block and they all blocked uh, Karnoth there. Oh, he righteous okay. fury a melee weapon. Yeah, I think so. Ah, well then, <laughs> I'll accept it. How about that? Right, so I've got, I don't think I need three hits to kill this guy. <laughs> Hopefully, you have another three. Yeah, it's basically the way that would work. Uh, if I don't know if that's a thing or not. All right, so that one hits, and we're gonna do. Oh wait, that. no! Ignore that! You ignore guys... that! Ignore that! That was the wrong. That thirty nine. Do you guys uh, auto confirm crits against Chaos Marines? No, it's only against Xenos. Uh, does forty seven kill him or no? Hey, he's outright dead. Okay, well then, yeah. Uh, so I quote unquote had to. Uh, I haven't moved, and I do have the ability where I can, if on a successful melee hit, I can. Move, f- full move or half move? Would you say half move? 
Half move. Okay, I have a thing where I can make a half move on a successful melee attack, and I had well, I haven't really fully moved, so I was like, which one? So I can move eleven. God, where's my mouse? So I'm gonna move right in here and just say this way. Someone seal that door, please. I sealed the door. That was oh. my action. When I moved oh. there. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Let, let me let me let me do that on the board. This way, brothers. I'm assuming you don't want to deal with what's behind that door. No, of course not. Hell no, we don't. Why don't we? I we totally do. It's fine. One of them's almost dead. Maybe. <laughs> you want a Probably. vortex grenade, and we'll figure it out. No. <laughs> hey, <I'm aware>. <laughs> uh, Brasora, uh, Brasora's turn now. All right, so uh, where are we actually headed? We are heading into this room. That is the command from the uh, leader. Right, he's over here. Oh, perfect. So one, and once we Take get in, we can your leader this and this door. And that's my turn. I mean, okay. Uh, Dominguez, go. Okay. We still no, have this can't. guy left? No, he's dead. Oh. There were two guys, and I killed them both. Wait a minute. Is that a person? Yeah, that's our uh, lieutenant. Guardsman. Oh, okay. yeah. Torian. It's a lieutenant. He tells you he found a way in. Uh, you see him, like, covered in, like, blood and guts and muck. There's a ventilation shaft he had to squirm through. Gross. I don't think that was a ventilation shaft. Oh no! He says the he's telling you basically all the blood and guts from that stupid moat is clogging all the systems of the uh, hive city was once here. You would do some type of check to see if he's lying. I believe him at this point. That's good enough if you want. The amount of times I have overridden his will with fellowship. Yeah, Dominic can roll scrutiny if you want. The bastard's lying to me. He's lying to you. Know. Oh, he's lying to me? Fuck that guy. Yeah. As far as you guys are concerned, he's a lying bastard about about all that. Wherever your characters want to do that information, go for it. Uh, so what are you doing, Dominguez? Well, I just do a full move to okay. this corner right here, so can't do much. Okay. And then it's there, the enemy's turn. Okay, sweet. Okay. One, two, three of you out there. Can you remove this guy so he doesn't confuse everyone? What guy? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. By the way, we're all consolidating in this room. Gotcha. So it is their turn. Uh, do, 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 do. Who is this? Beerlo? This yep, is that's no one. me. Okay. Bye. Where are those other nice two rookies? Uh oh. Oh god. Yes, attack that one, not me. That guy. Oh bye. <laughs> this might be a bad time. Good guys. luck. Where are, the, where are the other two goobers that are supposed to be with us? What, are what they goobers? Uh, the Tiberian recruits. and Lucian. The recruits. The the trainees I had. Yeah. They're probably still in that room where we're uh, They're still looking. fighting that one mutant you ordered all the humans to fight. Oh my god. Oh man. <laughs> they got confused. <laughs> We're fighting these guys too. I haven't seen their their markers in that's, a little while. And that's I just probably where their markers are at. No, uh, I'm looking over there, and they're over there. Uh, in oh, fact, really? you actually don't see them at all. They seem to be a, missing for some reason. Did we leave yeah. them at the base camp? No, no, no. They came in. <laughs> no, with no, us. they came with us because we were sneaking. They did. In the, they were with yeah. us when we were sneaking. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. I was I was thinking. I was like, wait a minute, because when we moved down to here, I was like, aren't they we might not have just them? made the transition onto this map. Um, no, 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 no. I, I transitioned them over here. You, you yeah, no, no, no. They're with us because they came into the big room with us. Mm -hmm. You just don't legit see them. They're that good at being invisible. Chaos traitors. No. They've turned. It's an obsidian me. jaguar just... and a mortificer. They're really good at being invisible. Right. Anyways, uh, so. Which are both Ultra Smurfs successors for the happiness of uh, Boko. I know how much he likes his Ultra Smurfs. You're hilarious. Those damn Ultra Smurfs and their perfect gene seed. 
Yes, the the Ultramarines are Ultra Smurfs, and the Blood Ravens are Magpies. Yes. Okay. Do you, have a do you have a melee weapon for this? No, but I'm gonna try and dodge. You can dodge one. All right. Do you have uh, a step aside challenge? Step aside? Yeah, it's yeah. a really good. It's a I don't believe so. And these right. these critters look way bigger than the other ones you just encountered. Well, you I think I one. dodge one. The other one hits you. Holy mother of Christ! All right. Um, and he hits you 67. Where's that at? Oh, my two tens. 67, 67 is body. Let's, 67. Uh, let's, let's fake point that attack roll. You need 56? 56 would still be body. Yeah. You know, well, fake what point. did he get? You got a 76? Oh. oh, there's like no way he can fell. I mean, there is, but it's a very... So, Let's just fade point that damage roll and get that damage a lot lower. Yeah, so I'm going to spend a fade point on the damage okay. roll to re-roll that. Oh, God. How many? That's uh... it's, it's vortex grenade time. That, yep. Nope. Yeah. Not, not on us. That's why I said get through the damn door. We haven't had our dead. turn door yet. Grenade. We have to have our turns all to right, get through right. the door. We'll turn faster. So, 10 pen... I have 26 armor well, on the you, body. Didn't you go? Or no, you guys are below these guys, aren't you? They had 40 wounds. Yeah, we're below uh, the bad guys lot. in our speed. <laughs> in this order. Oh, no. It's not quite 40 wounds. Okay, so 26 armor on the body, 10 pen. So 51 yeah. minus 16 is going to be 40, no, 35? 35 wounds? Yeah. So that's going to knock out all my wounds because I have 19 wounds. So 35. Eight on the critical chart. Yeah, hang on. I'm calculating critical damage here. Uh, so oh, 35. Man. Hang on. 35. Minus 19 is 16. Thank you. You really want to kill us this week, eight, huh? eight critical no, damage. No, this is this this is the balance of this mission. It was they are high damage, very squishy. All right, I took tell eight. that to the other dude that had forty head armor. I took eight critical damage. Those are damage dreadnoughts the you're body. fighting. Not squishy. Eric, ladies, Look. you get are you getting my private box? Yeah, I don't remember ever receiving any though. Uh, quote no 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 because I no, everything on me wouldn't fit through when uh on me in the suit of armor. Oh, yep. so I got all your uh, grenade belts then. Yeah, it doesn't. F it didn't fit inside the suit. I have right. one with me. You right. have the okay. other. My PDF is broken, so I need someone to look up the critical damage on the chart. It's eight critical oh, damage have, in the chest. What type? Rendon? Yes. Yep. Oh, you're dead. Oh. Uh, no, no, no. Eight to the chest. No, eight to the chest. You're not dead. Uh, make a toughness test. If you fell it, you're dead. Oh boy. <laughs> Here we go. Have you fate pointed this stuff. Just, yet? just don't fail. Just don't fail it. Easy peasy. All right. To be fair, toughness. you could just burn a fate point if you fail this anyway, and then yeah, it's stay true. Alive. That's true. Yep. All right. What's my what's my modifier on this toughness check? So it's, it's just, just toughness none. Test. It's just just toughness. Toughness. Well, cool. I you succeeded. Oh, there you go. So by succeeding, you now are stunned uh, for one d ten rounds. Oh. Oh wait, hold on. Sorry, that was leg. Uh, you permanently lose 1d10 toughness. Ah. Oh, God. And you take 1d10 levels of fatigue. Oof. Also, uh, you suffer blood loss, but we're space marines, so we don't suffer blood loss. All right, let's see. That's five toughness. Five then, toughness uh, gone. Yep. Forever. That's yes. forever. Yes, I'm aware. Got it, by the way. Okay. Eight, minute, eight minute warning. So. All right. So, and then 1d10 for the fatigue. Fatigue. Too fatigue. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Uh, fucking. God damn it. That's the wrong button. Fat fingering all the buttons. There we go. Oh, God, and you can't push past them either without incurring an attack of opportunity from these guys. Oh, God. <laughs> I hope you have a melee weapon. I would assume that because uh, I. You have a knife. You have a knife. I do have a knife. That's true. You can also straight up punch him too. 
Apparently, I also have a lightning claw. There you Ooh, go. Oh, do you? Fancy. That would be very useful because that's uh... better than a knife. Yeah, it's way better yeah. than a knife. Right, whoever's no, got if you my... throw a vortex grenade, I'm dead. Like, I'm just going to throw that out there. I, well, I know. You'd have to make a dodge. Right. But to whoever's holding my grenades, this is what I brought. <laughs> okay. And, oh, yeah. Let me do the rolls for those those guys. Um, the Dreadnoughts. For the door. For the door. There's What's the range on them, though? It's thrown. Range of thrown. Uh, oh, I mean, so there's no the explosion range. Um, it's not an explosion. It's everything disappears and cease to exist. Right. Okay. What's the In what on? range? <laughs> I gotta pull it up. Hang on. Radius of three meters. Okay. All right. That's much more reasonable. Uh, but it teleports. Anyone within that's this area can spend a reaction to attempt to dodge out of it before the. F yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Three meters is pretty easy to dodge out of. Yeah, you could throw it right on them, and then he just has to run past them like a motherfucker. Yeah, it has a 50% yeah. chance of closing permanently on each round, and otherwise it reappears 2 to 10 meters in a random direction from its last manifestation. So, it's, not it's just going to be appearing Okay, It's randomly. just if you fail the dodge, you, you're, you're dead. You disappear. Yeah. You don't There's nothing exist. left. Which is great for when you need to, like, I don't know, delete a titan. Maybe. Or just delete a portion of a titan anyway. It's only Throw it in his head. Hey. Oh, three meter radius, so that's... Uh, oh, you guys are actually in six range. Meters. Six right. meter right. zone. But yeah. they, fully, they fully ran to get here, so they can't shoot you just yet. Yeah, you could throw, like, the vortex grenade here, and then yeah. we just... The rest... Actually, this person, this person, and this person just have to get in here first. Actually, no, those, these guys aren't the shooty type, are they? You guys are there. Okay. Never mind. You guys are safe. What do I and need to do to survive? That's when I need to disengage. Virlo, go. Okay. Actually, just engage and just, just your full move. Just you can just full move. So well, how do I disengage? Is an action. So how do I half move? How do I disengage? You say you can oh, disengage it? action, and then you can only do a half move because uh, I yeah, disengage. Yeah, yeah. All does right. He, does, he, does he take attacks of opportunity as he runs no. past no. these guys? Okay. That's why we're disengaged. Us. Got it. Uh, what is your movement? So let's see. My half move is seven. My full move is oh. fourteen. Oh. So you can move. Seven you can't years. get out of range. These things are fucking massive, apparently. God damn I it! Mean, he could get to like here, up here, and then you could. Uh, do you anything. can you can hold your turn. Actually, you know what? We can hold your turn. I can oh, deal with on. one of them at least. Or you can stab one to reduce its health and hope the rest of us get them killed before you. Uh, All right, uh, I think I'm gonna disengage itself as a full action, so you might be able to move further yeah. than half. I'm going to attack uh, this guy. No, nope, it's half move. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna You're attack. Gonna up attack. Yeah, because I mean, what choice do I have? You can hold your no, because you can hold your action and wait for us to do our action. Why would and then he you can hold move. his action when he can attack and deal? Because so I can vortex damage. grenade and then he can just run. And then they're and then they're gone. He just has to not cross the circle for the vortex grenade and get yeah. more than twenty meters away. So he just has to get to here. Okay, I hold my action then. Yeah, this okay. gives myself a better chance. Okay. Could I wait? Could I disengage and move, and then be able to go? To it's move? a half move, so it's seven meters. Right. Here, ladies, go. All right. I'm holding my. And your full act. move's probably only fourteen, anyway, so You're only gonna get here. I'm going to um, throw a vortex grenade. What's the radius? <laughs> three meters. He three just meters. The I'm basically just gonna throw it in the center of these guys, because uh, that covers them. Uh, they, all right. <laughs> Put a, let's put a circle on that, because so, that thing's going to start bouncing around in a second. Yeah, however, whoever did that. It's three three oh. meter radius. Yeah, radius. So, yeah. Yeah, uh, so a six meter diameter. Yeah. Anyway, don't that. step inside like this circle, whatever. No, 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 oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have to get 20 meters from the uh, edge of that. That's, that's safety. 
So how how often does this thing move? Every turn. Every round. So and every turn it here, move. Two D ten. Random Meters. direction. Okay, <laughs> cool. So I'll let you roll, or whoever threw it roll, and I then I'll I'll choose the direction. Ooh, we can use this scatter diagram for one. Yes, yes, yes yeah, okay. That's why I was like, I wanted to use this. Scatter so, diagram. And okay, each turn cool. has a 50% chance of disappearing. Yes. So it's a <laughs> roll. I have uh, a question. Hmm? Is it a three meter or six meter di uh, radius? Three meter radius. radius. Three meter radius, so a six meter diameter. Yeah, yeah it's uh, wrong. Give me one sec. That's six, di that's for six in radius, not. Yeah, and there you go. Go. around in here. So uh, there it is. There we go. Much tinier. Much less terrifying, but still terrifying. It's smaller than much. us. Okay. Somehow. We'll yeah, finish but... off this round and we can uh, end the session here because I got to get heading out soon. Okay, cool. Uh, and then I'm going to uh, move. To, to there, because half action to throw, half action to move, and that's as far as I can go. Parnoth, go. Uh, I'll just stay here. That that's my 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 my, my turn. Uh, keeper, go. Uh, didn't did uh, Tess hold his action? I did yeah, hold my Tess's action. action. Yeah. Do you want to use it before it? You should probably move it? now before the turn ends. Yeah, you go ahead. All right. I would. Speak. You can use, yep. Move, you can so... use your a full action to run away. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. <clears throat> and then he bravely ran away. All right, let's see. And he waddled away. Dun, dun, dun. Waddle, waddle, oh waddle. God. Well, the good news is you don't see more war. You don't <laughs> see more war beasts till the very next day. So I guess no. I'm out dun, here dun, now, dun, right? Dun, dun. Yeah. I guess just be thankful they grouped up on one guy instead of they splitting up. Yep. Well, they split up. We would have been able to parry all their attacks. Book of really wanted to kill us this session. <laughs> yes. Oh. I, can I go up, grab the librarian, and just drag him inside? If four so people gank one guy go. and two, two hounds gank him as For, well, uh, and then two hounds gank somebody else. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna grab Eric Ladies and just bring him right in here, sealing the door as I go. Just start throwing so, people. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. No. Well, first, 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 first. There's I a big cushion right over here. I have to do a thing. <laughs> Fate roll. One second. Okay, cool. You're getting yeeted at the speed of, not the speed of mock cheese, but I'm throwing you somewhere over here. Throw me into the pipe as a cushion. S sir, something dragged us into some chamber. We've made it our escape. Happened suddenly. Didn't see what it was. And then I'm gonna move. That was so probably what a half move. So there you go. All right, Heracles, you're in, and this door is sealed. Oh, I mean, I threw you a lot for. Well, I was aiming a lot further than that, but I'm really heavy. I doubt you threw me that far. Seven point six. That's that would be like seven point six meters. Oh, then perfect. I thought it was double uh, the strength check in meters. Yeah, but I, he's a big guy. Or a grenade, yes. Not a fucking space marine. Let's just do triple since he's in a Mark II. Yeah. Suit. He's in the suit. Hey, uh, are you done? Uh, that is, I think, everything I can do. Uh, I will heal Verlo when we're not in range of a vortex grenade. Yeah. Okay, Rosara, go. All right, where are we headed now? Away from the uh, grenade of doom. Uh, he's telling you you need to go this way. South? Yep. All right, turns over. Next. Uh, we gonna Dominic call it here. Still. Yeah, we're just gonna move you all guys, and then. All right. Uh, all which it. direction should I run? Southeast. Uh, south. Okay. Probably the, the sign that says this way. Yeah. The sign that said this way before it got deleted. 
It's right here. Oh, there it is. So that someone moved to me. By, took you all about an I hour said, to get get through all that nonsense. An hour? Come on, man. Yeah. Fighting takes a lot less time. Of course, fighting did. Look than that. Fighting. We didn't just moving, moving fighting. Moving fifty meters takes less time than an hour. Sure. Thirty minutes then. Give okay. Me that. I was gonna say because that puts be us in like four hours or less. I'll be generous. Thirty minutes. All right. God damn. God damn. That's it. Uh, uh, and then bad guys wait. turn. Wait. Did everyone go? Somehow my turn, my move went undid itself. There we go. Well, there was, I already shut the door. I don't know what's with the red line. Okay. I'm doing that for next time so we know the vortex grenades over there, not to go that way. Oh, got it. Uh, yeah, because we're going to have to remember to... Oh, do you want to do the roll for the vortex grenade now? It's been around, so probably. No. No. no it, it hasn't been, been, it has been my turn yet. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, bad guy's turn. There you go. It's spiraled to represent vortex mm -hmm. grenade. Death vortex. Yeah, yeah, they're just they're just gonna go the up they're just gonna go this way now. From here. Well, they're going towards the sounds, the explosion, the death, and where they know where their comrades are at, so Okay. Not like they're all gonna pile up in one direction. Uh and then these guys move up. They're not going to use them. Jesus. Six, seven, eight. I think that you guys hear loud explosion and crashing of feet and metal as they got through the first door. Beer low, go. Uh, I'm running. That's my whole turn. Eric Hades. Roll, and then once right. we get to get the car, not, or once we get the keeper again, we'll end the session there. Hang on, this fucking menu is stupid. All right, so I'll do the D100 first to see if it disappears or not. So on a what 51 and above, it disappears. Mm -hmm. All right, so it's still there. So it's going to move eight meters. And what's the uh roll another D ten for direction? Yeah. Five. Uh to the right of us. Uh oh. <laughs> That's our direction. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It'll buff. Just stay the fuck away from it. Karnoff, go. Oh, two next time, damn. Also, it just it deletes everything that it appears in. So it's just making holes in the ground out there. Man, so they have a chance of falling into those holes. Yeah, sure. Yeah, but it can also delete walls too. Well, it's a three meter sphere. Didn't you hit one of the creatures with it? They're all dead. Yeah, I, I mean, would it be on the ground or would it be hovering midair? It deletes the ground. It's teleporting all over the place. Yeah, it's a, it's a field like that just exists. It's a three meter. Yeah, no, I, I get that. Sphere. It's a three meter sphere. Is the sphere hovering in the middle of the air? In the middle, I of imagine the it's everywhere. centered on the ground. Yeah, it's it's centered on the ground. So like it's I mean, making that's a... that's what I'm saying. He did hit yeah. a creature with it, so it would have popped out where the creature was, where it detonated. Was that mid air? Because the creature has height. Be the ground sucks it in. He because he threw it at the center of, between the two creatures, yeah, not at, at not at a creature. Well, he was on the other side of one of the creatures, so he had to lob it over one. Also, it could be a time, uh, it could be a fuse, so sure, it may have hit one of them, but then it, like, you know, drops to the ground and then goes off. Yep. Anyways, Karnoth, go. Like, you know, oh, real I already went, I already went. What? Okay. 
Grenades aren't contact. What are you talking? Right, about? Exactly. Are... Grenades aren't contact. Sweet. Oh, you guys. Shit. You guys Grenades are not contact. Grenades are timed. You guys got fifteen hundred for that. RPGs are contact. FT. Okay, fifteen hundred. Eric, ladies, right, move. Okay. But a normal throw grenade, a frag grenade, is a timed fuse. So Eric you're Hayes. telling me you're very bad at timing it. Eric Hayes went. Okay, that was making. All right, no, sure. did you did you move? Yeah, Eric I, don't Hayes? He, I don't think he moved. Oh, move, Eric, ladies. Sorry. I thought you did. All that rolling. I thought I was dead. <clears throat> and you guys got. Uh, yeah, just, Eric Latus needs to move. So Eric Latus, he did. Measure my distance. Oh, wrong out. person. Here we go. Okay. Yep. And yeah, there is run. definitely more. Run. Yeah, more warhounds with patrols like that. There we go. That's my run speed. All right. Run. Jesus. Yeah, that's my run. Yep. And you guys encountered a patrol and blew through. A, what was it? A checkpoint just blew right through it. <laughs> encountered all the all the war dogs. Yeah. Damn. All right, well, shit, that was fun. I will see you all next week. Yes. Yeah, uh, Fifteen. You guys like that uh, encounter? No, we no. almost fucking no. died. <laughs> Very nearly died. <laughs> you threw two enemies at me that can both one shot me. I wasn't. They. Too... You threw four enemies in total. Six. Technically. Six. Technically, these space marines can one-shot you, too. Yeah. If they touch you. I think that's and how I'm not... we can't one-shot them because they're armor. They have no armor. Yeah. To you guys. The, yeah, the dreadnoughts that well, we shot at have no armor. armor. Everything else can very much be one-shot killed. Too. Right. right. The dreadnoughts have armor, yes. They to do. be fair, it's a dreadnought. Yeah. That part is true. And that's... there's now holes in the floor behind us, so... They're gonna have to try and dexterously step around stuff if they try and come through there. Right, so a good chance. Probably... Well, the hole is pretty much what th three meters. They can just step over. They that. can trip yeah. over it. Yeah, they can trip and get stuck. So, all right. If we don't make noise, they might think we're we're dead. So, sure. It's like yeah. the T Rex. Yeah. If you stand still, it can't see you. Well, exactly. I blew through the first barricaded door. So. <coughs> what, anyway, how much did we get? 1,500. 1,500. Cool. All right. I will see you, you all next week. You guys didn't enjoy getting hit. <sighs> yeah, no. see you okay. next week. You guys are so used to killing, killing things so easily. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, challenged you guys a little bit. The tanky true. guys aren't that fun. Tanky guys that hit like... Like uh, snowballs are not fun. Now, guys that can spice it up a bit are a little bit more like, hey, I'm going to be a little more cautious about what I do. Of course, that last chaos forces you fought, they could have, at least the machine gun guys could have killed you in one volley. So, hey, your, your definition of spice here is a ghost pepper, so. <laughs> That's not spicy. That's, I eat that for snacks. Spicy would be like Cal 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 California Reaper. Carolina Reaper, yeah, that's it. And I got one of those, really tasty. All right, well, I, I have to. to you, Boca, but your taste buds are a little burned. I have sure. to go help with groceries. I will see yep. you all next week. That was yep. fun. I'm gonna shower and shave and head out to combat. All right, all right, later. later. All right. Yep. Yeah.